Good evening, everybody, and welcome to my jewelry presentation. My name is Linda, and I am the corset of jewel lady. Yeah. And I'm here tonight because I have a lot of bling, a lot of fun bling, and we're going to um, get the presentation started pretty soon after we get uh, our people that join me. Uh, mostly all of the jewelry will be $5 except, hello, jo Lori, um, except my necklace here, which is our Z piece, and that one is 25 and I do have one for sale. So, um, yeah. We're just doing good today. I hope everybody's doing good out there. And oh, we have Lisa and Nancy and Mary and Lori. And oh, yeah, I did get some boxes in, guys. So I got a new, lot of new things to show, which is good. Um, we do uh, ship for $4, four pieces. And anything over five, five or more, I pay for shipping. So go ahead and enjoy yourself. Hi, Stacy. And uh, get what you want. Then you don't have to worry about any extra cost. So that's really a bargain. We're all looking for bargains, right? So we got, oh, there's Mary, and oh, everybody's here tonight. Good, good, good. I missed you guys. Yeah, a lot, I did. And I was thinking of, you know, different things I could show you today, and I, well, I haven't really ever showed you a complete, what I would call like a turqu turquoise motif, like everything is turquoise. So I thought, why not? I'll do it tonight. Hey, Shelly. So I hope everybody's doing good, and uh, you're ready to shop, right? Yeah, me too. So, yeah, the, the only difference is everything I'm wearing is $5, except this piece, which is our Z Collection piece. It's this beautiful necklace here, and it comes with its own earrings that, let me just see if I have them over here, I do. It comes with these earrings, and this piece is 25 But didn't I knock it up a couple levels by putting this one on with the other one? So this is what I'm talking about. This is what you guys can do with your jewelry. You just be imaginative. You know, just everything that you've ever wanted to look like or do, you can do with your jewelry. So, and there's Nancy. Hi, Nancy. Yeah, I'm going to wait for just a few more people to hop on and, and then we'll get started. So did everybody have a good week so far? You know, like have anything fun happen to you maybe out there in the world? Uh, I kind of think of what happened to me. Not much. Nothing. Oh, I forgot to dress up Lucky. I'm not going to bring him out now. Oh, no. Because he doesn't have any earrings on. I don't know. I guess I just forgot, right? So you know what I'll do is I'll start with these um, pieces that I have, which I only have one of, except I have one necklace. And it was part of a fashion fix, Sunset Sightings. And I have a couple of, well, not stray pieces, but extra pieces that I didn't sell. I just bought extras. And oh, good, Lisa. I'm glad that you had a great week. Um, I was going to go walking today. This was the weirdest thing. I was going to get up. I was going to go walking and it was like 8 a.m. and I woke up and I was like, I'm so tired. And I really wasn't sure why I was so tired. So I got up, I fed the cat. I thought, well, I'm just going to go lay in my bed. And I fell asleep till like 10, 10 a.m. My daughter's like, are you okay? I'm like, yeah, because usually I'm, I'm up early, but I just felt like a bear today. You know, I just kept wanting to sleep. The weather was really nice for that. You know, a little bit of the window was open and, you know, did that. And so it just took me a little bit of time to get my, my motor run in there. But I finally did, you know, did the usual, like the pick and save and laundry things that you have to do, right? You know, go to the food store, get things ready. Um, I made a delicious lentil soup because, you know, you all know I'm on this thing now where I'm trying to take off a couple pounds. And uh, lentils are full of protein, so why not, right? So I'll let you know how it goes. And then um, my son-in-law did some smoking of beef outside, which was heavenly again. So um, I added it to this one salad that I made, which I made with broccoli and some snow peas and some broccoli slaw, and then put uh, sesame ginger dressing all over it, added the beef to the top. So it didn't have a lot of carbs. And so yeah, it all turned out good and it was delicious. And I'm sure it's alkalizing. And hey, Christine. So, uh, you know, we all wanna be alkalized from the inside, right? Because then you don't get heartburn, you don't have inflammation and all those things that do so much harm to you. Well, Stacy, you have a reason to be exhausted. Not me. I don't know. Well, if I was pregnant, that'd be something for the National Enquirer, wouldn't it? But um, no, that would be something for me jumping off the home bridge, frankly, <laughs> for me. Um, but yeah, yeah, it was. And you know what? I 
didn't use that much dressing, but I let, I let it kind of marinate. And then I added a little bit of Bragg's liquid aminos to it to kind of give it more of a savory flavor. And a big old giant bowl of that and some of this smoked, beautiful beef that, I mean, I, I don't know. I, once, once at, at one time I thought maybe I could be a vegetarian, you know, but when it comes to cow, I can't give it up. So there you go. So back to business, guys. Um, if you would share, and I see that Susan has, if you could share or tag a friend um, or, you know, share it with somebody who would like to watch a jewelry presentation, you don't have to tell them it's $5. Let me surprise them when they really like a piece and they get it for $5. They're going to be jumping up and down because I know I would. So, all right. So I have these pieces left over from a fashion fix. And for those of you joining who don't know what a fashion fix is, every month we get five different um styles and they put four pieces together for that style and they're they're complete trend blends they they match perfectly for instance you're going to have a new york look which is you know high level chic and then you'll have simply santa fe which is again like that southwestern look and i have a couple of pieces left over so i'm going to start my presentation with those each one of these is five dollars so uh, except if you buy a whole set then that would be 20 because you're actually getting five pieces because each necklace set comes with earrings and if you like my necklace set you guys this thing rocks i have an extra one for sale and i'm just trying to move out inventory because well you know those 21 boxes i have coming well i got two of them so you know but then i'm going to order two more so there we go we're back to the same level right um, yeah, so if you could just share and, and keep sharing and, you know, if I give you my cards in your little packages, give them to people because the bigger I can grow, the more I can bring these juicy, delicious treats to all of us, right? So, um, let me get started with the first piece that I have. Let's see here. I just want to make sure that, yeah, this piece is 25. I don't know if I mentioned that. So, but I'm telling you, it comes with these earrings. These alone are worth the 25. It's not real turquoise, but I'm going to tell you something. It looks and feels like real turquoise. Again, another beauty of paparazzi that I just can never really figure out how they do this. I say it's the epitome of capitalism because it works and people buy it. So uh, I'm not going to complain with that. Even in a pandemic, people were buying and even more so. So, all right, let me show you the first piece. This is a sunset sighting. And I think some of you have this, but some of you don't. And those of you who don't have this, this is number 589. It comes with like um, tassel earrings, but I didn't put them on here. I just pulled the necklace out. So it's a gold necklace. Ah, uh, yes, ma'am, right here. Look at that. This comes with this piece here. Of course, this is separate. And if anyone's interested in that, this is number 490. I think a lot of my ladies might have this. Newbies don't. I tell you, this is a blockbuster right here. If you don't have it, you want it. And you can get it at any time, but I have a good quantity right now, so that would only be $5. This piece is $25. Look at this. Look at this. Like, can you stand this? And it comes with these earrings. So, I, I know it's a lot more expensive than the other pieces in our line, but let me tell you something. It's worth a lot more. It is so substantial. It feels, it's cool to the touch. It feels like real turquoise. And I have one in the package ready to go for anybody. Um, and I don't know if any of you are aware, but we get Z pieces every year. And well, we don't get them, we buy them. But um, they um, have them every year. And at the end of the year, they break the mold. And then they start all over with uh, new Z pieces. So this is a 2019. They don't make them anymore. They sold out and they're over and done with. So if you like this piece, I have one for sale. This would be the time to get it. Or the paparazzi hounds will be after it. And then it will go and you won't be able to get it. So um, let me show you this necklace that I have from this um, sunset settings that I have. And I have three of these for sale. So it's $5.89, it's on a gold chain, and it has this at the bottom, and it's like that fool's gold right there. You know, that, that shiny, I don't know what they call that. I think if my marketing manager is watching, she can shout it out. I think she always, she always corrects me anyway, but uh, on this. So yeah, this one, this one right here, and it does come with earrings, and I'm gonna show you, I'll show you the kind of earrings that it comes with. This is a different necklace, but I'm going to show you. They come with ones like this right here. Um, I just have it in the package and didn't take it out. So 
It's great. And let me put it on the bus for you so you can see how long it goes. I'm telling you, I was a trader today. I wore other earrings, not paparazzi. And you know what? I was like, my daughter's like, well, you don't have paparazzi on today. I'm like, no, I don't. I have a whole jewelry box full of earrings too. And it's like, but then you know what I'm thinking? They were heavy on my ears and I don't have that problem with the paparazzi ones. So, you know, we're back to square one again. It's a great line, but look at this. So this thing, look at how gorgeous this is. It comes just like this. I have three of these necklaces available. Um, the number on this is 589 and just go 589N if you want it. But while I'm in this um, package of mine, I'm gonna pull out the remaining bracelet that I have that would have gone with the whole entire set. Let me just take that out. And if you like this bracelet, this one here is 589B. And honestly, I'd buy them both together because they're that pretty. It's one of these like bangles, but the bangle opens up right here. So you can get it on your wrist, okay? And it's gonna fit everybody. And then it has these adorable little charms on here that are just so sweet and so delicate. So if you had this and this on, right here, let me stop that. You would have almost, for $10, you would have almost a complete set. If you didn't like the earrings that came with it, you could always swap them out with a pair of gold hoops. I believe I have some gold hoops here or anything else that you have in your jewelry wardrobe. So that is number 589. Three of the necklaces are left. One of the bracelets. I'm gonna put this back. Here we go again. I told you I can't do a show without dropping something. I think I do it on purpose though, so you guys will think that, oh yeah, that's right. She drops things all the time, right? Anyway, so. I'm gonna put this back in its little packet here. I always like to keep them in their own packages. I think it keeps them safer. It's good for the environment. It is, it is, really. If any of my regular people have this, please throw up hearts because this is drop dead gorgeous. And that is 589. Remember, B for the bracelet and N for the necklace. But if you wanted to um, get, I have one, let me just make sure, full set left on this. This one's $20. And what you saw is that bracelet in there. And let me just see, show you what else is in here. It was the necklace and earrings. And I'll show you the earrings. You can't really see these. I'll take these out for you. It's real professional, right? I'll just leave it right in the package. So the earrings alone to me are worth it. I know, isn't this great? I just feel so like, ooh, baby. It's really nice because it, like, I mean, okay, I have, I have like gray eyes, okay? But when I put this on, do you see that my eyes went blue? I mean, they really did. So here are the earrings. So you will be getting the earrings, the necklace, this charm bracelet that I showed you in this package, and then the last bracelet that you're gonna get, and that will equal the, um, because with the necklace, it comes with its own earrings. So that's five pieces that you're getting. And then you're gonna get this bracelet along with it. So if you're interested in the full set, just say, um, this one will be 589 BS for bracelet stretch because it does stretch. And look at how gold and beautiful that is. It's all like these little half or quarter moon pieces in here. So that is the entire set. And if you like it, this would be the time to get it. Um, I'm kind of thinking of um, um, when I, I'm gonna probably have a show of just exclusive leftover pieces from fashion fits, fixes that I do have. And some in some cases I have full sets. So um, if anybody's looking for something right now, because this set is gorgeous, like I said, the earrings alone. And let me just show you how these look. Look at that, really pretty. So. That would be something to think about. So you can either get a necklace for five, a necklace and the bangle bracelet for 10, or the bangle bracelet for five. And then in this one, I'm not gonna break up the set um, because it's a full set. So I know there will be somebody somewhere that will be looking for this full set, either now or down the line, and I will have it. And I, I think that, you know, I'm a firm believer that a lot of these pieces in paparazzi are going to become collector's items. Um, I think I've mentioned before, like Eisenberg Ice, 
you know, when they were making this jewelry back in the 30s, they probably didn't think it'd be collector's items now, and literally you can't get your hands on them. So it's just something to think about. Let me put this one back at the 589. Um, and it's just something for food for thought. Um, you don't have to run right out and get it. But I do believe if you take care of this jewelry, it will take care of you. You know, if you happen to be uh, more of an acidic person, on your skin, maybe at the class, put a little clear fingernail polish on so that it doesn't wear off some of the um, the metal that might be there. But that would be the only thing I think would be wrong with it, it, you know, from the standpoint of long lasting. But if you're not wearing it every day, then, you know, it probably isn't going to be an issue. While I'm on that piece of jewelry, I got a sample from Paparazzi, and I don't know if they're coming out with this, but it's the same style, but it's just the necklace. Hey, Elaine. Welcome. So this is number 142, and it has the tassel earrings. This one's in silver. And then what you have at the end of this one is all of this in silver, and what they call this is an orange necklace, so it's orange. And I'm not sure if you can really pick that up here. Well, let me put it on the bust for you. So this is just one piece. So if maybe you're more of a sil silver tone person, uh, you'd like this better than the gold. But either way, here it is in silver with orange. You saw it in gold with like that, that fool's gold coloring in here. They both look different. They both have their own looks. So, you know, again, for the price, which is absolutely affordable, you could go ahead and just get both because they're just that beautiful. And, you know, longer necklaces are really all of the rage right now. I mean, look at any fashion magazine, it's in there. So that, those two are longer ones today that I have. And then this other piece I'm gonna show you, get this ready, is a, just a shorter necklace. Let me get this out of here. This is number 90. And it comes with its own earrings and they call this a silver kind of bead. And let me show you close up. It's all faceted. You see how it catches all the light? It's got a pretty big table. The table is that part right there that picks up the light and then the faceting around the stone. And then you have all of this. And I'll show it to you on the bust. Again, this is absolutely gorgeous. And it's, you know, with the earrings for $5. But I got this pair of earrings from Paparazzi in the, in the things that I um, received now that are gonna go absolutely gorgeous with this piece. So this is five. And then, hey, Sharon. Sharon, Sharon, how are you? All right, this is number 135. And look at how well this matches. It's the same exact colored stone. And look at, look at these little leaves, how they're just, they're very light. Okay, number 90, it's for Susan. All right, I've got it. Susan, did you want to pick up the earrings to go with it? I matched them to this, and I think this is a hot, hot set. If not, I will put these back and let somebody else take them at 135. So let me package this up for you, and I'll put your name on it, Susan. And I'm telling you, they such a good deal. You are not going to find things like this anywhere, anywhere. That's what keeps all of us coming back because we know, we just know. And this is how it goes. This in here. So you'll notice I, I do try to keep them in. Um, okay, 135 for Laura, you got them, love. All right, and um, I try to keep them in their own packaging because I want you to become familiar with the names of the pieces, the ones that you like, because going forward, there may be one they make in a different color, and this might be the favorite style that you have, and you know the name, and then you'd go, oh yeah, I love that in that one. I'd love to have it in a red. So this here is a good way to keep you, you know, educated about what you're buying, and maybe if there's something else you like in the line that would be the same, you could get that. So let me get this written up for Lori at 135. I know, I know. What I like, you know what, if you look at these earrings, and these are going to Lori, so don't anybody be hawking at them right now. But what I like about them, there's ultra light. These things are like featherweights. They're really, really, really light. And if you want to see it close to the skin, look how that just sparkles and pops. It's just gorgeous. And, you know, 
because they only do jewelry, they, um, you don't have to worry about seeing yourself come and go because it's just, you're not gonna, oh, that's that stuff at Target kind of thing, you know? Well, Sharon, I think you have this one too, right? Huh? Yep. And you know what? This is that layering I'm always talking about. Take your other turquoise necklaces, maybe wear them and maybe like get the longer ones and go all the way down. And then you really have this really unique look. So that's just something to think about. And like, oh, this this is a piece. And like, I'm, I will repeat throughout the uh, presentation that, you know, this one is for sale. I have an extra one. And as Sharon knows, when these are gone, they're gone. They will, they... There's nothing you can do. Paparazzi doesn't have them anymore. They're gone. So if you want to get one, you'd have to find someone like me that has it in stock. So let me just get these for Lori. And we'll move forward on that. Um, it's a great, a great deal. Uh, and you know what? I mean, I have one. I'm keeping one. And I have one for sale. And I'm figuring on, I'm going to be, as soon as they make the release, I'm going to be buying up all of the Z pieces. And like, like I've mentioned before, then I'm going to put on an evening where I'm trying them all on for you. And if you like them, let me know and I'll pre-order them because, you know, I obviously can't buy everybody's stuff for them. And, um, but then you'd have them and you have them at the beginning of the season so that by the end you don't miss out because that's really what happened. I didn't really know how any of this worked. Kristen! And, um, you know, so that's how it works. And when you have a piece like this, it's just so fanciful, you know, just absolutely gorgeous. I mean, okay, you've gone somewhere, you're, you're at that wedding or whatever. You don't want to outdo the bride, right? But you're walking in the room and I think you look pretty hot, right? So isn't that what we all want? We don't want to look better than a bride, but we want to look hot, right? All right, so here's another piece that I have. And this is really kind of fun too. Let me get this over here. Only have one of these. This is $4.94, it's in the silver tone. And then you have these discs. Let me get the lens on here so it's a little bit more clear. You know what, Mary, it, I can't get any more. I have one for sale. So if you want it, I'll put your name on it right now. I have it in the package. It's $25 because I can't get any more. They're, they're gone. So right here, if this is what you want, let me know because I can put your name on it. You know what? You don't have bracelets, Sharon. I'll tell you why. And I don't know why they do this either. They have Z bracelets, but only the consultants that go to convention, which I'm probably going to go next year, can get them. And then I don't, we can't even sell them. We have to have like, um, we have to gift them out to people that were very good customers or, you know, I think they use them as, you know, if you, if you bring in like, you know, get me to the number 50 viewers, I'll give you a bracelet kind of thing. So a Z necklace, and um, it is our top of the line Z pieces, like in paparazzi, okay? And they, they make these beautiful pieces, and it, this one here comes with the earrings, and I had them here. The earrings come with it. And they have consultants, and the ones, and the ones that um, have the, you know, we get nominated for the best, the best consultants. They name a Z piece after them. And this one here is called the Monica, this one here. So they go ahead and they do that. And, and then, you know, that goes out there and we can buy them and we can sell them for 25. But, and that's, but if I took this out of here and I put it in, you know, the department store or anywhere else, I wouldn't get this for 25. I'm telling you, it is that robust. So, um, Okay, you know what? I'll I'll go to the end of the show. You let me know when you're ready because um, I can't I can't keep track of who's doing what. But if someone takes it, then you won't be getting it. And then you know I don't know. I'll I'll let you borrow mine. <laughs> um, anyway, uh, yeah, I don't know. I only have one. I wish I had more. But you know that's where I'm at with this pre-order thing. It, if they ever drop them down, because we're all waiting for them. Because this way, then I can say the. And when you see these Z pieces this year, they put last year's to shame. They're that beautiful and they're $25. So if I get it and you'd say, oh, I really got to have that one, Linda, then that's the day I put the pre-order in and you know, it's, it'll be a pre-order show of just all Z collection. It will be magnificent. I mean, 
these will be the pieces that you literally hand down to your granddaughter or your great niece or something. They're that good. So just everybody, just so you know all that. And let me just make sure. All right. Yeah. All right, so back to my necklace. Just trying to catch everything here. But if you want this, just say mine and just say are you sold and the number which is 19 i believe i said it was let me just make sure 19 sold 19 and then an emoji because if you don't put that emoji there i may not get it and then you will get really kind of like frustrated because you think you claimed it first and i never saw it so just just saying that okay 494 now what i like about this one here is the circular discs are very ornate look at all that lacing and then they have almost like a ruby like type stone in the middle really pretty and then what you get is a chain that'll have five of these discs really pretty all in the same kind of look motif so what you're really getting and it's going to take up a lot of real estate on your chest it's gorgeous though it's it's like you know you could wear that turtleneck with this in the winter it's going to be a statement piece or you can wear it in the summer when you just have like a tank top on another one of those yeah you know what the new ones coming out won't be like this at all they they actually work with different designers and get a new one made up so absolutely the mold gets broken on this one never to be again you cannot get it I like like I said unless there's somebody like me who bought one up and has it for sale but I'm gonna outsmart them at their own game because I'm gonna get you guys to pre-order what you want so you will have everything you want well before the season ends so yeah smart shopper right so you know and then that's when you have to say okay maybe um, I haven't they haven't dropped yet and when they do drop when they drop they put them out there as soon as they do I will put an email out or, or an invitation out on my page saying on this Saturday night I'm having Z collection pre-order night and I will try every one of them on for you you can see them close up and personal how they look on I can tell you how they feel and you will get a look of what they really look like which I think is really helpful when you're spending money like that and it might be a day where you will spend you know more than you wanted maybe you'll buy two but believe me when that occasion happens you will be so happy that you did that so yeah just so you just so you know that okay so if anybody is interested in this I only have one I love all of the filigree around there if you love flowers there's your little flower there and then you have these little kind of half half balls but they look like balls but because they keep the weight down on this Again, it's just an ornate, kind of pretty piece uh, that you can wear both in winter and in summer, depending on where you want to put it. Um, you could also wear it under that white collar shirt because it looks like there's enough of a drop here for the collar to come down. So if anybody likes that, it is number 494. And then I have a, one bracelet, and this is in the Urban line but it's really, really whimsical. Yeah, I, and again, I don't know how um, how much of a turquoise one they're gonna have, you know, I don't, I did kind of post some of the pictures, but then they came out with another bunch of pictures, so I don't know how many are coming out now of, of what. So, you know, stay tuned, because that's gonna be a night where you're gonna wanna get your shopping shoes on, seriously, because I know I am. <laughs> when they come out, it's gonna be like, bam, I'm getting those. When you're a true jewelry aholic, nights like that get you really excited because it's like, I will have on a look that no one else will have on. And if you think of what I've done here, look, I put my earrings on $5, necklace is $5. This necklace here comes with these earrings. They're cute, they're crackle stone, but I put on ones that I had. Then okay, then I put this bracelet on here, which if anybody likes this bracelet, and I have this all written down here. Uh, my bracelet is, oh, let me see 568 I can make a presentation of all this and then this is another bracelet here then I pulled out my turquoise rings I have a complete look and maybe go 5 10 15 20 25 30 35 and then 20 I spent like $50 I look like I'm worth a hundred you know 
$100,000, right? So yeah, you know, this is what I'm saying. You can have this kind of look and it's not breaking your bank no matter how you look at this whole thing. So let me show you this bracelet that I have. 568, Sharon, you've got it. Let me put your name on it. It's a really pretty necklace. Very flattering on. Yeah. Oh, no, sorry. It was the bracelet. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, one of these. 568 on that number here, if anybody else likes that. And let me give you the number on the other one that I have on. That is 441. This one here is 441. Right there. So 568. 441. But you know what? They look like they went together, don't they? Because they just do this. So if anybody likes the littler one, it's a cuff right here. And I, it's a more generous cuff. And I even kind of, this is my own, kind of mushed them together a little bit more. So, I mean, it's not going to turn. Looks good on. This is elastic. So it's really good. So this is 568 and 441 and 490. So that's that. That and 441. Well, and Sharon is my um, turquoise lady. And let me tell you something. She knows how to pick them because they're great pieces. That crackle stone looks just like, hey, Debbie, it looks just like you bought turquoise out at some, you know, Santa Fe store. It really does. So we've got Sharon on both bracelets. Anybody else? There's, like I said, 568 and 441. Then I have the different rings here and their numbers, so I can tell you those for sure. The um, This here one is 155, and then my pointer finger is 24. Some of you might already have these. And then, of course, this is number 13 right here. It's kind of got some white crackle stone in it. So today's like a turquoise day for me. All right. So I'm going to put this number 19 on the side, the other necklace that I have, only one left, and you can decide if that's something you'd like to have in your life. So, all right, number 125. I only got one of these. It is on leather. It is a bracelet with a lobster claw right there, two inch or about an inch and a half extender, all leather, and it has all of this. Again, this is like almost like a Simply Santa Fe kind of bracelet. Let me get this thing out of the way. We can't take these things off, so I want to make sure that you're seeing it the right way. See, there's crackle stone in both blue and green, and then you have that silver that's got all that kind of etching on it, then plain rondelle silver right there, um, and there's some black in there and tan leather. Very striking on. You know, if you're not a real glitzy person, I mean, I honestly could have put this on with what I have on today if I didn't have my eye watch on because... I'm wearing black and I have blue and it would have gone perfectly. So this will fit everybody because of that lobster claw clasp. If anybody is wanting this one, it's 125. All right, and then the last one I have on here is a necklace. And again, this was part of a fashion fix too but this is just the leftover necklace. This is the only one I have left from that set, and it's only $5. It's a real beautiful necklace to have. I love the color, number five. Here are the earrings. Earrings are very light. They're very faceted in a, like a, I'm gonna say like a plastic type of bead. Then you have a silver chain, and you have all of this, like lusciousness in that like lilac color. So let me put this on the bust. Um, you could wear this at any time, Oh, 125 for Elaine, okay. Yeah, this is your style, Elaine, it is. And you'll love this. It's just very, um, very s Simply Santa Fe kind of looking. So let me get this for you.
Yeah, you know, we were talking about diets, too. It's so hard to be on a diet, I'm, I'm telling you. Now, now I never thought about candy bars before. Well, yeah, I did. But now I'm shopping, and it's like, oh, I really want to get a three musketeers. Well, no, you can't. You cannot get in line. And I'm thinking, they do this on purpose. They do this on purpose, so when you're checking out, your hand just kind of goes like that. I was telling my daughter, I said the other night, my husband said, oh, let's go to Cousins and get a sandwich. And I'm thinking, oh, it's the mama list diet. I don't want to go. And so I thought, well, I'm only going to have a mini sub. And... Then we got up to the counter, and my mouth automatically just started going, I'll take a half a cheese and ham, you know, like, it's like, a, it just, uh, it just doesn't stop. But I ordered a small fry, so, hey, yeah, you know, I'm making a, I'm making a concession somewhere, right? Okay, and Mary, the 125 went to Elaine, so she has that one. She claimed it first. On my end, that's what came up, so I gotta honor that. So that's that. And um, I was at the part where I was showing you this luscious little beauty here. And this is number five. And it may not be something that you're thinking about now. Oh my gosh, you know, it's going into winter. I don't like that. But it's only $5 and it has those earrings. And you know what? <laughs> it's like that mini sub and the regular sub, right? Like you really, you, you're saying I want it, but you're looking at it like I don't really need anymore. Well, that's kind of my life. So, um, yeah, this year, if you bought it now, you could save it for the spring and summer because of that beautiful color, and it's only $5, and it's the last one I have. So, something for all of you watching might want to think about number five because sooner or later, this one will sell. Okay, let's put that out there. And I'm just going to move this over here. Oh yeah, I was I was getting ready over here and I was playing some Marvin Gaye. Is that the most awesome singer in the world, you guys? Oh, classic, timeless music, right? Um, I have a couple of these left and I thought, let me see if anybody wants any before I start packing things off. You know how you have your wardrobe and you pack it off? Well, I'm kind of looking at jewels now that might be more for summer. But not really. I mean, this could be worn in the winter. But I kind of see it as that, you know, kind of Bahama Beach look. And why not, right? Um, let me see here. This is number six. And it is a wood necklace with the wood earrings in that luscious color pink with the wood balls. I started out with probably about 10 of these, and I have three left. So, again, you may wear it in the winter, you know. Um, but you could get it for next spring, you know, get the end of the season stuff and then you have it when it starts because if you're, I'm doing a vacation next year. I didn't care. I've just decided that's it. You know, I'm giving one year of my life up for this. Next year, I'm going to wear a mask and go traveling. So, you know, this is the kind of stuff you want to take with you on that trip. And if you like this one, it's number six. And really, um, it's not one that you want to pass up because who knows, maybe they won't have it next year. Most likely they won't. All right, I have one of these bracelets left and one of the pair of earrings. This is all I have left from another um, fashion fix. So let me just see here. Let me make sure that's just 125. Okay, um, this is 259. So if you like the bracelet, say B and 259 for the E for earrings. Here's the bracelet, here's the earrings. I know a lot of you fell in love with this set. It's gorgeous. Hey, Galen, how are you? Welcome to our presentation here, our virtual corner where we show jewelry and all of it's $5, except my Z Collection necklace, which is 25. So if you like something, just say mine and the number and put an emoji and we will get the piece of jewelry out to you. We ship all uh, one to four pieces for $4 and anything five or more, um, I pay for shipping. So that gives you a lot of um, chance to buy a lot and not have extra cost. So $2.59 for the bracelet. This is Stretch. It's a great bracelet. And the matching earrings, is they're five. So you could buy the bracelet or the earrings or get them both, but they're $2.59. And this probably will be one that goes into the vault until next season or something. But here we go again. There's that little hint of turquoise. So honestly, if I didn't wear these today, I could have easily put these on because they are really tied in with that turquoise look. So, you know... It's just how you want to put it together, right? So that's that. And that is $2.59. $2.59 E for earring and $2.59 D for bracelet. That's all she wrote on that one. Okay, this pair of earrings. I have a decent amount of these left. 
We're getting more towards that dress up season. So you may find that you need something a little bit more glamorous or you just like glamorous earrings, period, right? So this is number 12. These are, and they call this, let me just get this. They're like silver and they have, I wanna just get the name right, if they call it a brown pearl or a tan. You can go either way, but they're calling it brown. Okay, so anybody who bought any kind of brown pearls, these will match. If you have, and I think Nancy, you just brought, bought a long um, brown pearl necklace these will match it exactly because that's what they do when they name something a color. That's why I always like to give you the name of the jewelry so that you can go, oh yeah, that will match that thing I just bought. And why not? I mean, we don't have to be matchy-matchy, but sometimes there's a time when it really does look good. So that's number 12. All right, I have two of these left. So I thought they'd come out to play right now. For those of you who like more of a petite earring, but you still like a little bit of bling, these are perfect for you. They're on the fish hook wires and they're in that wonderful metal brass. So number 15, right here. Aren't they gorgeous? Just gorgeous. They're not really long at all. Look at, and my other earring is just swimming next to it. That's just like that. So if you like more petite earrings, they're not heavy at all. The fish hook wires, remember they're lead and nickel free. Um, these are really great. I have two pair left and that's all they wrote on this one. So just something to think about if this is something that you feel you need. I, I often look at these and they look like little bubbles to me, like kind of champagne bubbles around that, that tear shop shape again. You know how they always say they tear shapes are great for everybody. So that's number 15. This here is a silver necklace. And I really like this one because, let me get this here so it looks pretty decent when I show it to you. It is number 29. It comes with its own pair of earrings. These are like little, little hammered earrings on the fish hook wires. And the whole piece is hammered. But what's cool about it is the ends move. What does that mean for you? Well, it means it's gonna fit you better. Did you ever have a necklace that just was too big and it kinda of like went out and it just didn't lay right? Well, this one will lay right because of that. Maybe you have a, you know, maybe a different, maybe a bone that sticks out, I don't know, but it, it will lay better than any necklace that you have just because of that there. But then again, it doesn't look broken or it looks really um, very, uh, from top to bottom, like there's no break in that necklace at all. That's number 29. Here we go again. You know, it's one of those necklaces in the silver tone that will go with everything. So you can get dressed up in this one. You can put it on with jeans. You can put in your silver earrings and you have that look that's ready to go wherever you go. It's just one of those kind of necklaces. It also has a two inch extender and a lobster claw clasp. So you can adjust it. Maybe you don't like them as that high, maybe you want them a little bit lower, you have the ability to do that in this one. So that, and then this one, let me just tell you, I have three left. So if it's something that is, you know, on your list, you might want to watch it for a while um, because they won't be around for long and they're not in, block, uh, in the blockbuster. Okay, this one here I always thought was really pretty and I'm really getting to the end of my supply. If you like pearls, it's really dainty. But it's not all about pearls, that's why I like it. Because you're only gonna get a little snippet of a pearl look and the rest is crystals. I gotta get this to lay right. Remember they're in their packages here, so. Okay. This is number 39. 39, and these earrings here are just those creamy pearls in a gold tone with the fish hook wires. Here's that two inch extender, which means there's a lobster claw clasp. A lot of chains going on here. And then you get down to this and you have the creamy pearls and this kind of bead that I absolutely love. It is like in this gold tone and it's like they put this Aurora Borealis coating over it so it has just that like rainbow effect 
on the bead. And you can see it a little bit there. You see what I mean? There's kind of a more of a rainbow. It's not all gold. Really pretty, really dainty. Um, I just think this is really gorgeous. On And of course, when you get it home, it would lay better because I got this little tag in the back. But for casual, sure. For dress up, absolutely. For coffee, let's do it. You know, I mean, it's just one of those pieces. And I love how they put those little crystals in there that just brings out all of that beautiful gold tone in the necklace and it just enhances the pearls. It almost looks like you actually bought this someplace and that it's real because there aren't too many pearls in the thing. So it honestly looks like, not that you're trying to, you know, sway anybody to think you spent a lot on your jewelry, but they, they don't need to know. I mean, when I come in with this on, do you think they're looking at me like I just spent $50 on this? No, they're thinking, uh, I, you know, I'm probably a very rich woman and, you know, let's go, let's go try to get that woman, right? <laughs> so, and then you look at my pocketbook and I have to be, well, no, honey, I'm, this is like my $50 worth of jewelry right here. So, yeah. Um, and this one here, like I said, I think total I have three of them left. Very pretty. Now, when I first started here, this I bought these earrings and I bought a ton of these earrings. And now I'm a little sentimental because we're getting down to like the last three of these. And of course, you know, in the beginning I had to take one of everything because I just had to. Um, and I love these earrings and I've got a lot of use out of them. And you will too if you get them if you don't already have them. 39. So Galen, did you want 39? It is beautiful, uh, really beautiful. Um, let me just see, like, yeah. I want to make sure on that. Yeah, so if you want that, just say soul 39 in emoji because um, I'll put your name on it, but I just want to do it the way that we have to do it so that I make sure I'm not missing anybody who wants it. Because I'm not, I can't assume that you want it by, by just saying that it's pretty. And if you want it, you got to tell me. So here, these are these earrings right here. Look at these. I love them because they're in that pear shape. They're with that roped gold. They have the bling at the bottom end. It's just so feminine, so pretty. Fish hook wires. Look. Look at that. Okay, I'll tell you what. Um, just send me a personal message through um, my um, Course of the Jewel Lady page. And then just give me your email address and your residential. And I will send the invoice to that. And upon payment, I'll get it out to you, okay? So that's how you do that. Just make sure I get your email. And they're yours. And, they're, and that's gorgeous. And then you're in my system, so anytime you want to come in and buy, all you have to, you know, you're ready to go. And I'm getting a lot of really, really good stuff. I'm in this because I love it. It's just a beautiful line of jewelry. I love what I do, and I love the ladies that come to see me every Wednesday and Saturday night. And um, we have a blast. And, you know, and now you'll be a member of the club. So, hey, welcome to our tribe. All right, Kristen Cohen, 45. Good Kristen, you know, right? Look at that. Babe Factor earrings. Kristen, that last hair that you had, was it Bobby? Oh, it's like, whoo! I have that same color hair, and that that Bobby in that Almond Breeze, bam, it's really good. You're welcome, Gaylene. So let me get these for Kristen. Come on. 45. And I have to get to the point where I have to say goodbye to some of these things because I've had them for a while. Remember, I'm, in November, I'll be coming on my year in paparazzi. So um, it's a bittersweet thing because I didn't really know if I was going to be doing it that long. And now I really love what I do. It is super sexy. It really, like, I took one look at your picture and I was like, oh, wow, Kristen, woo. You know, like a um, you know, man magnet there. Yeah. That, but that bo Bobby is such a good style. It's just the way the hair, where uh, how it lays, it's just perfect. So yeah, I just want to put that out there. To, you know, if you haven't seen Kristen in that hair, you got to go find it because she's good. So on this one, I only have two pair left. So if anybody wants to jump on board and get these, because they really are pretty. They're in that drop hoop style, but I love all the bling at the bottom here. And who couldn't use another pair of gold earrings, right? I mean, that's just the way it goes. 
I need, I need to have all kinds of, I need all kinds of jewelry, right? So two pair left. Let me know if you want them. And then I noticed paparazzi's really up in their designs. They're just getting better and better and better. It's really crazy. Yeah, she did. My little, my grandson goes around and he'll say stuff like, Oh, it's crazy. And I'm thinking, where do you get that from? Well, then I watch one of my lives. I say it all the time. I'm like, no, kids are like sponges. They pick up everything, the things that you wouldn't think they pick up. I'm going, well, isn't that crazy? He says crazy all the time. So, so damn. All right, now, let me get this one out for you. This is relatively new it's been shown before but for those of you who may not have seen it or were on the fence about it this would be a perfect time to pick this up i also have a matching bracelet and i don't think i pulled that maybe not maybe i did no i did not um and i can get it if you want it this is just one of those kind of really it's just really pretty i'm all the time you need to be careful it's when you like some bad word comes out of your mouth because you just burned your finger on the stove or something. It's like, oh. Anyway, this is number 52. It comes with these earrings faceted in that it's in the brass. So you're gonna have that kind of gold tone on there. And then, and of course you have the two inch extender here with the lobster claw. So let me pull this back so it lays properly. And then you have all of this, you guys. Look at this. And I have a bracelet that matches this. If you want this necklace, it's 52. And you can tell me, get the bracelet, and I can go pull it at the same time. It's just delicate and sweet, unassuming, but gorgeous. We all like that kind of sparkle, don't we? I mean, we really do. I know I do. And when you see that, I, I mean, my eyes are on, automatically drawn to someone's neck who would have something like this on. And, you know, maybe it's because of a love for, for jewelry and just because they're pretty, very eye-catching. So if you don't have this one and you want to get it, and another thing you can do with this is put this on the tightest setting and then get another one and put it on the longest setting and you could do two of these together and that would look really good too. And right now I would have enough that you could do that and that would be $10. But like we talk, when I'm driving through Starbucks, I'm spending $10 for me and my daughter and I'm not buying a cake pop either. That was the biggest waste of money. My grandson always wants a cake pop. I said, I'm not going to buy you a cake pop. I mean, it's one bite for two fifty, dollars right? No, but then I'll, I'll, buy, I'll make you a cake. Don't worry. So if anybody wants this, it's just really, really pretty. Look at that. Isn't that? I get mesmerized by this stuff. Really pretty. 52 And the bracelet looks just like it, except it has elastic. I might have pulled it, but honestly, I've been pulling a lot of stuff. I have a lot of stuff here tonight. So let's see. Oh, this is brand new. I already have one that was bought. And I only have three left. And so let me take this one out here. I'll even have to open the wrapper up on this one. So this is one of those wraps. We all love the wraps, right? This is number 251. It is a long wrap in the brown leather with that brass on it. Look at that. And it looks like it goes on and on and on forever. It has three settings on there, which means you can wear it if you have a larger wrist. You can wear it if you have a smaller wrist. Let me just, I'll just put it on the biggest one here and wrap it up for you so you can see. Dang tags in here too. So what you end up getting is something like this on your wrist, however it fits you, double, or you can have a little X going on there, but it's really neat. But for all of you young ladies out here who don't have a sagging neck yet, perfect choker. And honestly, I loved chokers when I was younger. I just love them. I think they're really feminine. I, it doesn't work for me anymore, but that's okay. You know, you, you kind of accept where you're at in your life, right? But I'm just saying, if you're in your 30s, this would rock. In your 20s, this would rock around your neck. So, or if you have a good neck, you know, you could just. So, 251. And I have only three of them left. And it just came in. So, um, that's how, how it goes.
Tassel earrings have always been my favorite and these are in silver and I have a decent quantity of these left. I like bringing them out. Well, I like them in the summer because they're very whimsical and fun and funky. And then I like them in the winter because they just remind me of, you know, you can get ready for New Year's Eve and they're kind of, they're different. This is number 55. They have like that concave post part in silver and then this lovely silver, gorgeous tassel. I mean, look at that. I mean, if that, you know, wear your eye makeup so you're more in like the cool tones and a lip color that's just gonna complement more of that silver and no other jewelry. And this is all you need. And maybe tie your hair up with this. But if you're not, 251, okay? Let me get that. Yeah, yeah, that's gonna be perfect for you. So if you haven't gotten on board yet with tassel earrings, think about it. Because, yeah, they're not your normal thing that you're gonna wear, but when you put them on, it's like, wow. At least that's how I feel. I feel like, now again, I do a lot of designing in that, and I have gotten some of these um, oriental tapestry kind of fabrics that, and have made like jackets out of them. So having something like that, and then this tassel earring with that, it's just like, you know, with the oriental kind of the look on there, it's really, really pretty. But I mean, the good part about this is that they're only five. And so you aren't gonna break the bank. I mean, if you go to a department store, you're gonna pay more. Would you wear them? I don't know. If you tried them one time and said, you know, they're just not for me. I don't think you're gonna say that, but I think that if you put these on, you'd decide that, yeah, you know, um, I really do like them. So let me get this over here. I threw that in my bucket. I don't want to do that. So, yeah, this is number 55. And I have, well, I bought a lot of these. I just felt like most people would, over time, really want to come into something like this. Because once you start doing the line of jewelry and you get used to all of this, you know, now it's, I never would have worn turquoise before. I just wouldn't have. Now I have it on and I'm like, wow, this looks great. Look at that. I mean, it's just gorgeous. Right? So why not try something like this in silver? It almost looks like you have a silver earring on, but when you get close up, again, there is that, um, I don't know, it's kind of like, it reminds me of just something oriental that you will have on with this. So if you want to try something different, know that I have them. They're still here. And like I always say, there's no problem in my mind because this jewelry always sells. Necklaces that I bought in the beginning where I bought a huge amount, I thought, I'm never going to sell those. And I don't have them anymore. I mean, they do go. People will go through your inventory on your store. And the next thing you know, you're down to the last one. And it's like, how did that happen? So I have another very dainty little petite necklace. And on this one here, I have probably four left. And... I basically bought it around um, Valentine's Day because I thought everybody would like this, and they did. I mean, it really went, it was very, um, it was very popular. However, I do have these and I kind of forgot about them. So I brought them out again because some of you just really like hearts, right? 56, there's those tassel earrings again. A very short, petite necklace that's all sparkly. And then there's almost like a one carrot if you were going to put this up against a diamond it's almost like a one carat size of a little diamond heart you know maybe you always wanted that little piece of jewelry that just was right here in that little hole that's all i want is one little diamond heart like that and of course you know that's probably not in everybody's budget right now with the way that you know things are going in the world with rents and jobs and pandemics but if you want that look, you could have it. Now, this is the one that I would tell you. If you happen to have acidic skin, I do not, but my daughter does. Her skin will eat gold, and I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. It eats gold. So I would tell you on the back of this, put a little clear nail polish, and that way it won't turn. Okay, 56 for you. It's just going to be one of those ones that you can wear, and you can layer it too. And, and um, okay, you know, good, perfect. Right, let me get these out for you guys. So, 
So you could, what you do is you get your, your appetite wet with something like this and you say, wow, I really like that. And so if it ever comes a time when hubby says or your significant other says, I want to buy you something, and you could say, well, I want to have it made in the same kind of gold chain and either I'll spend the money and get a diamond or I'll just put a CZ in there, a heart, and it won't cost a lot and then I'll always have it. But for right now, the $5 one is great. I mean, it, it just is. You can have the look. And you can give it a try, because maybe after you wear it, you think, I don't, know, I don't think I would really wear it. I liked it then, but I don't wear a lot of it now. That's what happened with a lot of my jewelry. You know, when you're kind of going through your phase of your life, oh, I have to have this, you know, I have to have this in 14 karat gold. Well, they're all sitting in the jewelry box now, and you know, I'm wearing $5 jewelry. But the thing is, you can't, that jewelry can't keep up with trends. This can. So you, put, you tuck it away and you take out something else that you really like and you have it. So I have Kristen and Gaylene and Nancy, okay. And then you can come back to it and you can say, yeah, I had a lot of fun with that one. And, um, and like, again, if it's just an absolute favorite of yours, then you get it made and then you wear it and you don't ever take it off. You know, I wouldn't swim in this stuff. I wouldn't take a shower in it. You know, I wouldn't, I wouldn't put any harsh chemicals near it. It is fashion jewelry, and it's meant to be fashion jewelry. And if you're going to wear it every day like your signature piece, then buy two of them and alternate them. And again, put the little clear nail polish right where it hits the skin, and it won't come off. But um, I kid you not when I say, like, my daughter literally eats gold. I don't know what it is. There's many rings that I've bought her in gold that we had to go get redone because she'll just eat them. So, um... Okay, you got it, Kristen, right here. I'll put your name on it. You want it, don't you? Yeah, I'm telling you, you want this, and I wish I had more. Um, yeah, let me put this, your name on that, Kristen, because fabuloso, you are going to rock like no other in this, honestly. And there's nothing wrong with having a little bit more um, variety let me get that one for you. All right, so back to this. I got Kristen for 56, Galen for 56, Nancy for 56. Kristen wants 19. Oh, yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah. And you can do so much. You take this one out, okay? You can just wear it like that. That looks good. You put that one in, it's a double, a double up. You can do so much. Ask Sharon. Sharon, have. Sharon, if you love your necklace, throw up some hearts. You know, I'm telling you, we we sell looks here. We sell attitude here. And you know what? I didn't have this attitude before. And now I do. And now it's like, I don't want to look like Linda looks. You know, I'm going to put on a different hair today. I'm going to put on a different color hair. You know, I'm going to go out of my, my orb. I'm going to put on turquoise. I don't think you guys, except for maybe one time, where I've come out in turquoise. I'm going to come out and I'm going to layer it up and I'm going to, I'm going to be doused in it. But you know what? Why not? And so if you like a matching braid, oh, I think, Kristen, you might already have this. And then this one here is 441. Yeah, the bangle is 441. And, of course, I think, Kristen, you have all the uh, rings to go with it anyway. So, but you have a lot of rings. So, you've been, you know, you'll be good. So, uh, anybody left on the heart necklace, I have three left. If anybody wants it now or at the other people who are going to be watching it, you know where you are right there. You can't watch me. It is number 56. That's why I'm very adamant about holding up my numbers because I have a whole crew of people that watch me on their job. And... They can't put the volume up, so I always, I really want to make sure I have cue cards for them so that they can put it down on their wish list. Oh, do you ever, like, okay, we all played with Barbie dolls, right? I mean, Barbie doll was my in to, like, fashion and jewelry and absolute love. The one love of my life, I was, I was born... In 1955 and then 1958 they came out with the Barbie with the ponytail and the striped swimsuit and I always wanted that Barbie and kids if you're listening my birthday is coming up so anyway I always wanted that Barbie and then my mom went out on my birthday I think when I was six 
and got me the Babette doll. And I was like, I don't want this one. I want Barbie, you know, because Barbie was so fashionable. And she had those little shoes that had just a little piece that fit over your toes and the high heels on there and those pointed sunglasses. And I mean, that she rocked. I was, you know, five years old and dreaming about the, the outfits I was going to design for her. And you know what? That started all of this, the jewelry, the hair, the wanting to be the best version of you. And that's what we do. That's what we do. That's what we like to do. We like to get dressed up. We'd like to look different. You know, and even if you're minimalistic, because I was just saying this to my daughter the other day, when I was in my teens, you know, I hair up and a little pair of hoop earrings on and you're running out and you're cute, really cute. Well, when you hit my age, you, there's no more doing that anymore. You gotta, you gotta work at looking good. You know, it's just, there's no pair up and you're running out the door. So, you know, while you have it, while you're in it, wear it well. And even if you're a minimalist, just throw on some pieces of jewelry. You'll feel so good about it. Oh, I know. I know. Well, then I finally got a real Barbie on my, I think, seventh birthday. And then, and then that one had, it was, um, she had the bouffant hair and it was in platinum. So I think that right out of there came my love for Marilyn Monroe. And she wore this big old gown and she had a cape on and it was maroon. And it was like, then it was like, oh, I know what I'm going to make now. And that's my life when I grow up. I'm going to do all this kind of stuff. But I mean, who didn't have a Barbie? And uh, that person... Whoever designed that was brilliant because it just took you out of baby doll mode when you were little, right? So I have another necklace here that was part of the fashion fix that I, I um, ordered extra necklaces of. And like I said, I'm coming to the end of the line on some of these. Let me just make sure. I think I have five of these total. And if you like this one, this is only $5. But it's got, got that mechanical feel to it. So maybe you're not glitzy and maybe you're kind of hard edge. You like more like leather. You'd like to put, wear a pair of boots, have some leg warmers sticking out of the top. By the way, I got my leg warmers the other day. I said, now I feel like Rose Kennedy and just put the blanket on me in the wheelchair because I had these things on my legs. And I mean, it was like, it felt so good just sitting on the couch with my leg warmers on. So if, you know, if y'all think that it's not, it's not uh, cool to have them anymore, they certainly do the job. And I, I'm really happy. And I even warmed bed. And I really loved it. My legs didn't cramp either. So I'm, it, it helped. Anyway, back to jewelry. 63. All right, it comes with these earrings and they are kind of like faceted. You can kind of see the, maybe you can't see it there. But here you can, see what I mean? It's all got cuts in there, faceting. So it's going to match what you're gonna see. Then it's on gunmetal. And then all those little um, circle things you saw at the top, well, they're all here. And then they have gold. And then they have the bigger ones here. It's gorgeous, and I am, as you probably all know, a magnificent musing. I love this look. This this necklace is five dollars, you guys. Five dollars. You can't even get what a mocha frappe for that. You can't get you, what you can get with this is absolutely amazing. So if you're on the fence and you go, well, I don't know if I'd ever wear it. I can guarantee you, you're going to put this on. You could put it on with the white collar shirt or the turtleneck or just a low cut dress or a neckline and you are really going to love this. And you can pull in your own gold earrings if you want. You can wear a pair of golden hoops, they'll look good. But I'm just saying, I just have the necklace left and why not give it a try? Then you might find out that you really do love the mag Magnificent Musing Fashion Fix set when they come out because they're kind of mechanical like this. They're different and just so much light comes off of this. I really don't want you guys to miss out on this. I mean, if you have it, if you bought the whole set and you love this, then send up some hearts. But really, I mean, it looks so much better on than you can even imagine. And I buy extras because sometimes people really want them. And I've had a couple people like cancel on orders, not a lot. And then sometimes I just buy extras because I think they're really pretty. And over time, I know they're gonna sell. But it is really one of those pieces that I think you would enjoy if you got it. And it all goes according to taste. But remember, with this line here, we can have a different taste because we can, we just can. Now this is a new piece. And this one is in gold. Brand new one, so get rid of 63. Oh, and Sharon wants 63, okay. Good guys, because they don't make this anymore. I just happen to have extras.
Okay. Oh, Kaylin, thank you. Huh. I love you. Come back to every show, okay? Keep saying that for everybody, too. Um, yeah. Well, you know what? Um, I am a firm believer. And I mean, I don't always follow my own rules and everything. But I think movement helps and what you put in your body. And you know what? It is just really, um, you know, it's hard. We have a battle going on because, and I... I've mentioned this before. We're all kind of a hook to like the fast food thing. You're either going to work, coming home, buying pizzas for kids. You're all stuck in it. And um, it's not the best food, but somehow we're in it. And if you can kind of get off of it, but it's hard. You know, I, I just got to say it's hard. So, um, yeah, you know, it is what you put in. Get movement. Try to get movement every day if you can. I do try. I do try to get, even if it's a walk. Or I'm a swimmer, I like to swim. So, but swimming in chlorine will eat your skin, it will eat your suit, it will eat your hair. So be careful on that one. So, all right, back to bracelets. This one is really cool, you guys. 249, it's a cuff. Look at this. It is so shiny. It honestly, it looks like I have, you probably have them too, 14 karat gold bracelets. It's just, it's just a dupe. I mean, amazing. And then I love how they did the little end caps there. This will fit everybody. You're going to get this on. I've got a lot of bracelets on here, so it's hard for me to put it on. But look at that. Now, looking here, it looks like rose gold. And I thought, is this rose gold? But on the package, they say gold. But it's a very light gold then because of just the way they make it. Um, I just want to see here. We have to keep the tag on when we're showing it. It gets, it gets annoying at times, right? So there we go, 249. Drink lock, yes, yes, yes. All the things that they say, you know. Did I get 63 for you? Yes, I did, Kristen, I did. Right here, your name right here. Kristen, right there. So I did get yours, honey. Um, yeah, so if anybody's looking for a gold bracelet, and we sell a lot of different gold ones, um, but I'm telling you, do an arm party. Now, I know Elaine sent me a picture of her arm party one day. My daughter came down today, and she had on our little, like, slinky kind of bracelet one that I showed the last time I was on. She had that one on, and she had one on from, I think it was one of our um, Sunset Sightings fashion fixes, the bracelet from that, and it looks so good. I, you you know, you look and you think, oh my God, she looks like she has a lot of money. You know, again, we're not doing it because we want to look like we have a lot of money. But what, I, what I'm saying is that it makes you elevated. It looks like, mm, you know, that's a very stylish person. So if you like this, this is brand new. And I only have, let me see here. I only have six of them. No, yeah, six of them. So... That was when I was buying a smorgasbord. So I only have six of those honeys. All right. This is one of my favorite longer necklaces. Let me get this out for you. And I gotta tell you why. I'm just a, a fan of snake chains. Okay, what's here? And Galen, bracelet 249, I'll take it, okay. Yeah, you know, you're smart, Galen, because if you get them, when I first get them, you won't be sad when the next time I come on and I only have one or two left and someone claimed it before you. And like I said, I have a whole crew that watches me after this. Um, if they don't watch me at work, they're watching me later. And there's a lot of stuff. Like I always say, the day after I do a live, I am slamming busy all day long. So let's get Galen on here. At 2.49. Yes, I am. I just sold out my last one. But, um, yeah, that's all she wrote on that one. Sorry, Susan. You know, it, it just I just had one. I wish I had more, but I don't. I can check. You know what I'm going to do? I'll check another box because we haven't really... Um, you might all be aware that I have redone my, my um, boutique here. 
and I'll check one more box, and if I do it, I'll PM you and let you know that I have it available. It's $25. Um, I did buy a lot of Z pieces, but what I had in this area here. So for right now, I think I only have one, but let me check. It didn't make it. So there's 66 for this. And then you're gonna get these little earrings on here. And I call these drop post earrings. They're unofficial wires, but the little thing looks like a post. It's got a little gem in there. What I like about this though is this heavy duty snake chain. Wow, 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 right? For $5. And then look at this medallion at the end. The most magnificent color, faceted bead. Look at the facets on that. And the bling at the end. I'm gonna get you close to this stone. Look at that color, you guys. I love the faceting. It's not your normal faceting either. Doodad earrings. Yeah, I do call them doodad earrings too. So that's the color of this. But this chain. So on this, I just, I'm bringing out more longer necklaces. Because the season is here where you're going to be doing more and more like um, bulkier sweaters and things where you don't want anything on your neck. Could be a turtleneck. But if you like this one, that color is so amazing. And I also have rings in this color. Let me just pull one out so you can see. I have to go around because I got all, all boxes here lined up of things I'm gonna show you. So just take a little sip break on your drink there. Okay, I will get these out. Yeah, these, oh, these, these rings here will go absolutely smashing with this and that's what we build on here you know you get a piece with that color and then maybe the next time I'm showing something and it's a ring and it has that color and and now you have almost a complete total wardrobe okay this is number 37 look at that see the ring you have on what you have on here a wow total wow or this other one and I'll show you the difference between these two, but let me show you. This one's 31. Okay, 66 for Kristen. This is 31, and that one too. And let me write Kristen's name on one, then I'm gonna come back and show you these rings. And anyone else on 66 while I'm going in the bag to pull these out? And I can tell you right now what I have left is one, two, I have four of them left. So this one here being 31 and this one being 37. The difference is this has got a lot of faceting on the stone. Can you see it? It almost matches, almost matches the one in that pendant where it's just really faceted. This one, on the other hand, has just a table in there. You see the table? And then the faceting goes around on the inside and around the stone. This also has like a double ballerina setting. It's the same color, but they give off a different effect. So if anybody, and I know a lot of my ladies here probably already have this ring, but for those of you who don't, I still have a decent number of these. This being, again, 31, 37. And they go with this necklace. And the necklace is just a beauty. There's even some bling right there let me get close on that so you can see that right there and okay mary wants one too but that jet just is so gorgeous that color i mean you can't go wrong in that color you just can't there's just some colors put on this planet that are just gorgeous and that just is one of them And then I was talking to my daughter, too, and I said, you know, I like this so much. If I did it for, like, 10 years, I'd be, like, 75 doing jewelry, but I do like it, you know? So I said, well, maybe I'll do it, you know? Maybe I'll just be that lady that comes on who sells jewelry and, you know? Because I, I, when, once you get into doing this, it's like you see so many beautiful pieces of jewelry that you go, wow. And then when you can share them with people that come to your presentations, it, you feel like you're letting them in on a big secret. Okay, one for Eileen. And I didn't see you come in, Eileen. Hello, hello. Welcome. So I'll get one of those for Eileen. So now I just have two left. 
The snake chain is the bomb on that. So, yeah, I I don't see any reason either. And, um, you know, I obviously not now. We're not doing anything. But, you know, we, we're, you know, talking to, like, our, you know, IRA people and all that. And I was saying how eventually I'd like to get maybe um, a two-bedroom, two-bath kind of condo in Florida, you know, on a second level. So that, you know, we would have, like, when you're in Wisconsin, you have places called up north. You know, everybody goes up north. Well, you have to shut those cabins down in um, the winter and you have to open them up in the summer and every weekend you have to go up there. So I said, what would be kind of nice is if we get something down there, you're in a vacation spot. And then, you know, I'd go down there three, four times a year if I want to. And then my kids can go down there. So we'd get a lot of use out of it. And I was thinking, well, I could even do this out of my house there because all I have to do is have a mailer and what I bring. So... Yeah, so, I, you know, the thing is, it's portable. So if anybody's looking for something that you want to bring in extra income or you feel like you'd like to do something different in your life, let's talk. I mean, I can I can tell you all about this, and I'm not trying to sell anything. I'm just saying it's a great opportunity, and I'm glad I did it. So let me see here. Oh, oh, that's so wonderful. And Dallas. Oh, that's a cool place. My brother lives in Dallas. Debbie. Debbie Jansen lives in Dallas. Frisco. Um, yeah. Yeah, we're in Wisconsin, Galen. Yeah. Yeah. All of it. So, you're in Milwaukee too, Galen. Well, you know what? Then you can pick up. I can, um, when you um, are ready for, um, you know, when you're going to get your package, I can tell you where to come and get it. You know, so we'll talk later. All right, let me get on to the next one. Only had two left on that really beautiful one. But if anybody else is looking at rings who didn't get these already, this, yes, I always have to look, 37 with the faceting and 31 without. And they're just gorgeous. And remember, these are stretch back rings. And I, I know you're looking at them going, oh, stretch back ring. I did that too. But really, if you have a swollen finger, they don't ever see the back of this. They're gorgeous. Everything in here is gorgeous. You wouldn't know it was a stretch back. And so, yeah, I know. Good, good, good. I'm so happy, Galen. Please come to all of our, our um, presentations here. They're great. I try to get new stuff in all, all the time. All the time. Oh, my God. Yeah, there we are. Susan from South Milwaukee. <laughs> my brother. Oh, that's a piece of work, right? Okay. Back to the jewelry. You see my little, like, uh, my presentations all the time. Now he's probably getting tired of jewelry, but I don't. I love jewelry. All right, number 69. What I like about this one here is there's a crackle stone, right? And then I have this piece. Now I showed one, I think, about a week ago. It had green. Here's the red crackle stone. Here's all this lacing in here on all of this. I mean, it's just magnificent. To think this is five dollars is crazy. Again, this was one of the pieces that I bought when I first came into the line about a year ago, and right now I only have three pieces left. So you know, when I first came in, I bought a, like a whole bunch of stuff, and over time it's kind of dwindled down. So um, I guess this is what you could call vintage paparazzi. But boy, does this thing look fantastic on! It really does. And you, you can wear this in the winter. And you can have on the boots, you know, with the, like I said, with the leg warmers at the top, your jeans on. You can have a bulkier sweater on, this hanging out, some big, you can wear the earrings that come with it if you, you know, have to put a mask on, it'll be real easy to wear. But if you want to swap out a pair of, like, um, more lacy kind of silver earrings, right here, 69 Okay. And I don't know how familiar, Galen, you are with our jewelry line, but, um... There are a lot of people that hunt down this jewelry once they get addicted, because for $5, you really do get addicted. I mean, that's how come I'm selling it, because I got addicted to it. Uh, it was one of those, I honestly did not think I'd be doing this, and here I am, so. Um, but I'm happy, I love what I do. It's really good. I've met a lot of fantastic people, and I think there'll just be a lot more people that I will be meeting along the way to do this. All right. He could never mimic me. I got it down. I got the patent on it. So good luck on that one. So anyway, here we go. Anyone else for 69? 
Well, I think that's that's why I say that it is the epitome of capitalism. Because if you make something so affordable, people are going to buy it, right? And they're not just going to buy one piece because now all of a sudden you got a ring that matches the necklace. You've got the necklace that you've always wanted. You didn't have to spend a lot. Maybe you spent $20 and you're getting all these different looks. You can go to church with them on, you can go to the restaurants with them on, you can go to work with them on. You know, I mean, there's just a lot of things you can do. So um, on this one here, I only have two left now and that was the number 69. So if somebody wants more of that robust, you know, real presence of a necklace on, that's the one that you wanna get. And let's just kind of roll back the tapes here a little bit. I'm going to bring this out again because I'm going to match it to a few red pieces that I have. All right, so these were the earrings that I said I just bought. Some of you already bought them. These are timeless. They're also in that pear shaped. Oh my God, you can have so many different looks. Just like wigs. You know, I mean, all of a sudden you're like, well, I, I, want the, I want the blonde wig, and I want the brown wig, and I want the platinum wig, and the curly wig, and the long wig, and the short wig. And, you know, all of a sudden you have this ability to be morphed, to be something that you feel good. I mean, who are you fooling? Nobody. You're not out to fool anybody. You're just out because you like the way it looks. 377. These earrings here have, let me get close up on these. There's this blackened silver, and then there's a red crackle stone. The back of these are finished off like that. So it's just not an empty back. If you're wearing your hair up or you have shorter hair, it'll look really pretty. What I wanted to show you was these with this piece. Because right now, what did I just do? I just took that little accent and I'm wearing this. So we're gonna put this up here. And now I've got one more piece and I'm gonna put into this, which is It's a lot of fun. I, I think that, you know, people from all walks of life like doing this. They really do. It's just a lot of fun. Here's the red bracelet at 141. So let's go back here again. It's hard to hold. The red earrings are 377, the necklace and the bracelet. You see what I just did with this whole set? I really took it up another level. Now, wow. So the bracelet's 141. If you like that, it's five. And guess what? It's a cuff. And it's going to fit everybody. And then if you're petite, you just kind of work on it a little bit to kind of move it. I'm not saying bend it out of shape. I'm just saying kind of really, really kind of move it in. If your wrist is a little bit bigger, kind of move it out a little bit. Again, don't be bending it out. You're going to break it. But it's just a pretty, pretty set. So I have two of these left of the necklace. You saw how, how I just took it up a notch. That's number 69. So let me put 69 back. And this one here. Get my little card. And um, if you liked just the pair of earrings, 377 for the earrings, yes. And this, just this. So I'm just saying. So I'm going to get a pair of 377 for Galene. And Gaylene, have you ever heard of paparazzi before? Gaylene, not Gaylene. The good thing about paparazzi is every consultant, 69 and the red cuff, bam, you got it, girl. Um... The thing that's really cool about paparazzi and even the different consultants, everybody will have their own take on it. Someone might lean more towards the Simply Santa Fe kind of Southwestern looks. Other ones will be running the gamut. Other ones will be doing it, you know, from their living room with a camera in front of them. I mean, it's however you present the jewelry. But um, I like making a night of it. I, I really do. I think that it makes it fun for everybody to come in and have a good time and really enjoy their jewels and get some kind of like imagination going. Like, how am I gonna wear this thing? How is this gonna look on me? And it's gonna look good because it looks good on everybody. And the red cuff, the red cuff here for Mary.
And if anything ever goes wrong, you know that I'm going to take care of you. So, you know, don't feel like you have to not let me know about something because, you know, if you, if something breaks and remember it's fashion jewelry and it, it goes through a lot of shipping. So something might happen to a clip on it. And you know, if we can't work on a way that we can get that fixed, like if you're close by, you can bring it by me and my husband, he's like a master fixer. I mean, he's talking about like if the little clasp thing comes off, well, now I'm going to add a little super glue to it because it'll never come off. And I'm like, well, whoever has gets that piece of jewelry is going to be really lucky because nothing's ever going to happen to it. So we, we make every effort to make sure that you have the jewelry and you are whole from buying it from us. So that's just one thing I want to make sure that everybody knows is that, you know, always feel like if something's not right, you let me know. Because I wouldn't like that if I bought something and it wasn't right. I wanted this. I want to make sure I threw in your earrings, Galen. All right. I believe that I did, but I'm going to put them on again right here. Okay. So, so much for red, right? But I do have them. And these are really nice. And like I had mentioned last time, it's always nice at cause of this price that you could throw some of these into your go bag in your car. If you're going to go to a gym, you're going to go work out and you always have that little kind of like, you know, this toolkit for looking good. You know, like there's a pair of earrings in there. There's a bracelet. Um, I spent $10 on it. So it's not like I'm mean, if anybody, you know, breaks in my car, take it. I'll go get another one. Um, okay. Cool. Yeah, he really is. And you know, it's kind of funny because now he wants to get one of those things and he was telling my daughter, like you can, the little magnifying glass with the little light in it so he can really do a good job. I'm like, okay, and I told my daughter, it's your job now, you go find that thing and I'll pay you. But um, yeah, so there's a, there's a lot of stuff that we do here that's a lot of fun. And you know, I want to make sure you get exactly what you want and the style, and I'm telling you, don't be afraid to try other styles. If it, the worst comes, the situation comes that you just don't like it, there's somebody in your family that would like it. Regift it to, like I said, your favorite um, waitress somewhere. Like, I'm not saying wear the earrings for a year and then go do it. But I mean, if you wore them one time and you're like, ah, I'll just swab them with some alcohol and, you know, I'll be on my way. So, okay. Yes, I do have another red cup. The thing is, these are relatively brand new. So, I'm buying in bigger lots now. And... That's good. We'll see how fast they go now, you know. And then you know that you need to bump it up a little bit. Yeah, um, with Alana's Space Elixir, I, I put that on my business page too. I'll put kind of fun little things on there. My daughter does create a facial elixir made with essential pharmaceutical or therapeutical grade essential oils and she mixes them with carrier oils that are fantastic. I listen, I swim a lot. Chlorine eats everything around you. I come home and I cleanse my face and I put this elixir on and I swear it keeps the, the skin elastic. So if anybody's looking and I know there's a lot of facial products out there, but there's zero chemicals in these. I remember what you put on your skin will be filtered by your liver eventually. So when you put something that's good on your skin, if you can eat it, then it's good for you. I'm not saying take her elixir and eat it or anything like that, but basically that's kind of the same thing. When it's all full of chemical names and stuff like that, it's going through your liver. Um, you know, use it sparingly then, but with this thing here. So if anybody's looking for a fantastic facial elixir, I think it includes just some, even rose oil. She's even putting rose oil in there. And do you, you get this much rose oil for like, I don't know, a hundred dollars. So it's really, it's a lot, you know, and it's, it's just a great thing. So you have a red ring. Okay. So you don't want the bracelet. Is that what I'm reading? Oh no, I see here. Yeah. I didn't have any, no. Yeah, you have red rings. I know you have some because I remember. Yeah, super. 
But if anybody swims, honestly, Lisa, you're a swimmer. You know what I'm talking about. You need this elixir. It is like when I, I'll have four drops. I only use four drops and I rub them together. Make sure my skin's a little, um, after you cleanse it, a little bit moist. And then just kind of lay into it and push it in the skin. What's left over, I go to my cuticles. Real up there, see Lori too. I'm telling you, this stuff is like heavenly. It just is. I'm really glad that she um, did her research on this and really pulled out the oils that are really fantastic for skin and the carrier oils. That's a real important thing too. Well, I have a pair of earrings and I have three of these pair left. They're 238. These are post. They have, they're in a burnished copper and they're like little flowers on here. So I know there were a lot of people looking for post earrings because you really can't wear the dangles at work. A lot of people can't wear dangles anymore because we're all wearing a mask, they get caught on it. But um, if you're looking for this, and they're, they're posts, they're not, they're not clip-ons, they're posts. I have three of these left. They're pretty, they're very delicate, really pretty, nice. You couldn't go wrong. It's a great, if, if you don't like big old earrings, or like I said, you just can't wear them in your life right now, then yeah. And the Elaine too, everybody, the ones that use it are, are just swearing by it. Like, I'm like, when I start, I, I cherish the drops because I don't want to, you know, I used to use a lot more of it. And then it got to the point where too, that was like too much. Like the skin got used to it. So um, it's just really good to have that feeling of if you've ever gone into a pool and you swam and your fa face felt like it just shriveled up and it was seven layers deep of, of no moisture, that is 238. Um, that's how my skin would feel. And it was horrible. And this elixir, it just brings the elasticity and the feeling I can move my face again. And I know people say, well, why do you swim then? Well, it, if you ever swam, and I'm talking, I get in, I swim a half a mile to a mile every time I'm in. If you've ever swam that much, you don't know, you the, the um, endorphins that get you know, released in your body are, it's almost like a high. And your sleep is that of an infant. So if anybody has problems um, sleeping, get in a pool. And I'm telling you, even if you can't swim, walk up and down the lane. Just keep walking. And that water, the, pressure, the, the motion of the water will go on your lymph system and it will start releasing, you know, extra water, extra things on you. It's really, no, I will never stop swimming, but... You know, the pool is the, you know, they got to put chlorine in it. You're just going to, you're just going to get that. So, so Shelly gets the 238. So what I'm saying is, you know, I will never stop swimming. I got my kids in the water early. I've got my grandkids in the water. They love it. Um, it's just something that, that's who I am, but I'm telling you, it's so therapeutic. It's so, um, relative to where you're at. Like for me to go walk up and down in the pool, it would feel good, but not really for me to do like the workout I do, I'm done. I'm, I'm sitting in the chair and it's like, whoa. But somebody else who doesn't do that would get in the pool and walk the lane, you know, just keep walk, walk for half an hour in the water. And you would find that, oh, you're, you know, you're stimulating your, you know, urinary tract, you're stimulating and getting everything and you're sleeping really good. So for those of you who say you have sleep problems, if you have a club nearby or a Y that you can get in maybe before the crowd or after, because there's something now with the Corona, the way the, the moisture in the air, they say it, it pushes the, the coronavirus down to the floor. So it doesn't really affect, but you can't go in a pool with your towel. You can't go, you can't go in the area with anything. You have to just be you. So yeah, yeah, it's really good. And I'm just uh, keeping that out there. Bucket number one done. three buckets tonight guys so hang tight here because I got a lot of stuff to get through okay clip on earrings mm -hmm. we have one person in our tribe here that doesn't have pierced ears so I had gotten a couple pair of clip-ons and I'm really glad that I did because sometimes you're just just tired of wearing pierced earrings sometimes you even though these are really light and they are really light um, you just don't feel like you want to wear them anymore or you want to use clip-on earrings to clip the longer necklaces up, or you want to use them on a purse or in your hair or on your shoes. There's a lot of things you can do with clip-on earrings. 157. They are demi hoops. Look at that. Get close up on these. 
look at that. Almost like, let me get the name of these because I think this kind of explains why they look like this. Couture Collision Silver Clip-On. Well, to me, they remind me more of a jungle. You know, it looks real like uh, like you'd find them out in a, like a rainforest or something, that, that design. So, 157. Oh, I just had some Ninja Red before I came on. I love it. I feel like inside again, all the antioxidants. Kristen, yes. I knew you would get them. I probably, I should just put your name on a up here and then go, oh, I already have your name on them, you know. But I want to make sure. The good thing about Kristen Cohn is she has figured out how to make other earrings, pierced earrings, transferred into clip, clip earrings. So she's our like house expert on that. And she has done some amazing job on her earrings. So she gets to enjoy the earrings that we have too. But I also do this as a courtesy for her. Whenever I see their clip-ons, I will buy a couple pair because uh, like I said, I, I just, I think there are days when I'm just tired of wearing them too. Yeah, I would too. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't ever go away from that. That's why I buy them. And then, like I said, some days I get tired of wearing them too. So I've been putting them on and some of them are so beautiful. And I just found a picture back in my disco days. Remember I told you I was always wearing my grandma's jewelry. Well, I got a pair of clip-on earrings in there, you know? So, I mean, who wore clip-on earrings at discos, right? I did. I'm telling you, I love that stuff. Oh my God. Lisa, it's your whole family, I bet. Lisa, Lisa. Just waiting here on the answer, are you? Are you related? All right, I have, I have a, a decent number of these. This is real pretty. This is in brass, and it's a pearl necklace. And oh my God. You know, there is six degrees of separation. You guys are just is. We are all related somehow. Wow. So anyway, 705. You start out with the creamy pearls on a brass setting now. So it kind of puts the elegant level down a little bit to me. It's not that you couldn't wear them or anything. Um, but I like it because it can put to a jean, kind of a jean um, look too. And then it comes to one pearl here. It just has a different kind of look to it. Not all dressy, but you could wear this being all dressy too. Like it's kind of bubbly, like champagne kind of looks like that. Hey Rose, I was just thinking about you. Like, where's Rose? And then all of a sudden you came on. I'm a psychic jewelry person, hey? So anyway, look at this. I mean, what's really cool is that you do have the brass metal lining up everything in there and then you come down to like the one pearl here and it's pretty it's just really pretty the earrings match it perfectly i wouldn't switch them out to do any other kind of earring but it just is a very elevated look but not so elevated that you can't just wear it casually either so if you like pearls and you don't have this one um my strong suggestion is just just get it because you won't regret it it's really pretty and that's 705. And Lisa, that is so cool. You're, Lisa's husband, he was like related to everybody here, right? I mean, everywhere we go, there's someone that knew your husband. All right, this is brand new, you guys. Oh, brand new. Very, see what I mean about this is like our virtual corner. We come here, we meet all these people here. It's like, this is why I wouldn't want to give this up because I've met such wonderful people here and I get to show you fabulous jewelry. I mean, it's a great job. And I'm retired. Okay, are you ready for this one? Because this one is the New Year's Eve necklace. This is truly number 10. It's in a gold tone. You can be wearing this as a choker if you want. Look at this. I'm going to put the lens on for you. Then I'm going to put it on the bus. You can't, you don't have to wear it as a choker, but let me tell you, okay, all that. See, bam, 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 pearls, big old pearl shape and pear shaped. Then you have the, the necklace. So what you could do is you could, you can wear this as a choker, like up here and then layer other like 
Like, for instance, hold on. I'm gonna do something here for you. And I have this necklace too, so if you want that, I can pull it out. I'm gonna put this on. First, I'll put this on just laying down. So you got the, that, and this is how it looks, just laying down. Number 10, look at that. Woohoo! Lisa wants number 10, okay. Let me get that out for you, Lisa. And I'm gonna come over and play here a little bit. Now, I did get a good number of these because I just thought, whew, this one, this one is cool. So. Okay, Kristen Cohn, does that mean you want one? Because you say, I love it. And Rose is like, so anybody who likes it's got to say, Susan Brookhouser, Brookhauser, I got one for you, Susan B. What's your name? And then I'm going to show you something fun. Okay, I have enough, Alana. Because I wasn't buying a smorgasbord this time. I was really going in for the kill. Really going, I know this is a big one and everybody's going to want it. So, um... Kristen Cohn gets one. And Alana gets one. Yeah, Kristen, I got your name on there already, so you're good. You are good, love, really good. And Alana gets one. Okay, so, and Shelly, I, I, you've got a wow there, so I don't know. Um, Rose and Shelly, if you want this, you have to say soul number 10 in emoji, just so it registers. Okay, so you see this, right? All right, this is what happens when you make it into a choker. Now, this is, this is how Linda would wear it. No, so you know it's going to be over the top, right? Because that's just who I am. Oh, shoot. Just bear with me. All right, this here is an ultra choker. When you kind of, you could even go choking around your neck. This is on the last one, but if you layered it, now I have this one for sale too, but I have to go pull it. This one, remember, I think you, a lot of you bought this one with this. Okay, this is just smashing. Remember smashing? It looks smashing, darling. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna layer it and I'm gonna show you how this looks. And it is gorgeous. All right. And this is what you can do with your jewelry at home. So you are gonna be very unique. You will not think, oh, she bought that at Kohl's. No, she didn't buy it at Kohl's. All right, you can do this. Ready? Bam! Look at that. Decadent or what? Or you can take this this one here, this choker. Oh, no, that's not the choker. Sorry, guys. And you can wear that up. You can make it more like a choker. I can't wear chokers. I, I just can't anymore. And then you have that choker there, and then you have the necklace. So number 10 is this one. On this one here, I would have to go pull the number and look. I know I have these two. And now, uh, let me go pull it to make sure. If you don't have that one, you want it. Sure. If I can find it. This is when you, you're not ready for a show, and you know, I am ready, but I pulled out something that is still, and I gotta find the number of the thing. I'm getting a lot of inventory here now, so it's 
getting harder and harder to find things. And I'll tell you what, I know I have these. So, if anybody likes this long Y gold necklace, just say Y gold necklace. Sold Y gold necklace. And this one is yours. So you saw me put them together. I have this. A lot of you already have this one. It's fantastic. The earrings alone on this one are worth the $5. I'm not kidding. But uh, when you have this piece like that, that's in incredible. So just if you want that one, say Y gold necklace, sold Y gold necklace. And I will get it because I have to pull and I don't know what the number is. I'd have to look at my computer or I can't find it on the board. I know it's here. So anyway, let me get this one all together and just hang that up over here and then we're concentrating more on this gold one again it can go here you can wear them you know maybe if I lose like 50 pounds but then I'll have all this hanging skin so I don't think I ever can wear it as a choker anymore but anybody who's in their 20s and 30s certainly can um, but let me just take that out so it's number 10 so anybody else want one number 10 let me know you know the combo is fantastic so what I have for number 10 right now is Alana, Susan B, and I got Kristen and Lisa. And I want to make sure that's who I have here. I've got Lisa and Susan B and Kristen Cohn. All right. And then Alana. So that's it, guys, on that one. All right. Um, let me put this over here with that one. All right, we have these things called blockbusters in our line. And what that is, is when we run out, they will always be available. And periodically, I'll bring out the blockbusters because they're kind of like the staple in the line. And then every day, we have new releases. So 90% of what you see here are the new releases. We go in every day, we purchase our jewelry, and that's what I show you. This piece here is one of my favorite blockbusters. This one is a blockbuster. This I can get any time. They're all $5, but um, you might think, oh, you know, like this one I can't get all the time. I've already told you the story on that one. But this one was one of the first pieces that literally brought me into the line. There, are, there were two. There was the Glitzy by Association earrings. There was this piece. So some of you may already have this, but I like to bring it out periodically for time to time so other people can see it. <laughs> it is like being in, I literally get anxiety before it's like the two drop. It's two o'clock and then it drops and then it's on. And literally you got to get in and get out and get to check out before. And, and Stacy, if you're watching, you know what I'm talking about. You can throw some hearts up because it is like that. I mean, you no, know, it really is. It's like the anxiety, the cortisol is running because what you put in your cart, you may not get. It depends on who's in front of you and how many they ordered, and you have no idea. So, you know, you're, sometimes you're thinking, oh, I'm going to get them. For instance, I'm going to just show you this, and some of you already have this. This ring here is number 149. She's a, she is a beauty, right? Decadent, gorgeous, all of the above, sinful. I love it. It's gaudy. It's $5. So when I got in and I got 20 of these, oh, I can't do a cartwheel, but I did a cartwheel that day. I'm telling you this, and it's for sale. I have them right here. I actually brought it out today. I just thought it was pretty. And for those of you who don't have it, or you want to get an extra one because you want to gift it to somebody at Christmas, because could you imagine somebody, I mean, if I opened this up, I'd be like, holy smoke. So um, this ring, if you like, it, is 149. This is what I'm talking about. This kind of ring, it within 30 seconds of it going out into the, the new releases, it's gone. So you get in and you put out however many and you get out. And the day I got out with 20 of them, I was literally doing cartwheels. So that's just what I'm talking about. So the back to my piece that I'm going to show you, which is number 134. 134. This piece here. It has the doodad earrings right here, little ones. It's got the lobster claw and the extender. It's a longer necklace. And it is 
this piece right here. You're looking at this right now and you're going, how can they do that for $5? Which is what I'm saying. How do they do this for $5? Check out the faceting in the stone. Now, any of you who have it, please throw up a heart because when I say this is weighted, you know what I'm talking about. This isn't like a piece of tin with a piece of glass. No, this thing feels like it is like, wow. Look at this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show it to you on the bus. If you want one, it's 134. 134. You want a 149. Okay, let me grab Kristen here. And there's nothing wrong with getting a backup. And I'm gonna tell you because you keep it in the wrapper here so that you know it doesn't, it does nothing happens to it, and then you have it when you need it. 134 for Eileen. Okay, let me just get this for Kristen, and then I'll write you up. And then I'll I'll show you how you can play with this jewelry too. This piece is an absolute stunner. And the jewelry, well, first of all, the ring is an absolute stunner. So if anybody needs 134. I mean, 149, sorry. Um, this blue ring right here. For those who of you who are watching later, that is, honestly, when that goes, I don't have any more. I can't get any more. I sold a lot of those. Okay, I just want you to know that. So that one I cannot get. So let's see Kristen going here on her backup. And then I'm going to show you a few things. I got to get Eileen and Susan on the 134. Yeah, I remember, and you know, Rose, our Rose wears a lot of longer necklaces. She's very classy in them. She looks wonderful. And um, when she saw this one, it was like, wow, that wow. And, and I'm not kidding. It was, it was a wow moment for her. So let's get this here for Eileen. This one I can get at all times. So if something happens to this one, um, you have left it at someone's house or for some reason fell off of you, you can get another one, okay? Not that you want to have to go out and get another one, but you can. You can get another one. All right. Susan B. And I just stocked up on these because... They are worth it. And Kristen Cohn and Lisa, all right. And I'm gonna show you some fun things you can do with this one. So let me take care of business first. We got Lisa on that and Kristen Cohn. You know, in some days, like everybody else, you go, oh, I don't know if I feel like going on tonight. And every night that I go on, regardless, and I have been here like faithfully from day one, I'm so happy that I did go on because they are very good nights. All right, so right now on this one, I, I start out with Eileen wanting 134. Um, I have Susan wanting 134, Susan B. Lisa wants one and Kristen. Okay, so now you take, you can wear this one long and it's gorgeous. Literally, you're, you're just gonna flip when you see how gorgeous this one is. But I'll put it on the bus for you and then we'll play around with it just to show you how long it is. It's gonna be a long one, you see? That's okay, it's okay. Now, you can do a thing called loop and swoop. So here you have it on, like this, like this, and you're gonna put it through, I'll put it on my little bus and do it for you. Kinda of eye it through, obviously it's gonna Okay, so what I did is, I it's like a scarf where you take it and you go through the, the chain like that. It's gonna obviously be a little bit shorter because no one's neck is that size. So it's gonna come up like that. And then you're gonna have this little thing here. I'd put it on, but I, I have so much on right now it would get lost in that. The other thing that I figured out you could do with this one that I like to do, all right. Look at the eye of that. You take and you go through that eye with both with your chains kind of like a round way that you can put the chain in twice and then what you end up with is this I can't really do it I mean I guess I could take it apart and show you but you're gonna end up I'm gonna just take it apart and show you okay yeah I'll definitely get you one it's a great Christmas present oh wow she's gonna be so happy
Yeah. I'm going to take this one off and just show you guys what I'm talking about because this is so cool. Mary, you want two of them too, all right. Okay. It just doesn't get any better than this necklace. And I hope they never take it out of Blockbusters because it's just one of those ones that anybody who sees it will absolutely love it. And I just wanna show you this one thing. We've got time, we're here. We can just sit around and play jewelry, right? All right, so basically what you're getting is this. This eye right here. You're gonna take your piece you're gonna put it through, I'll use this side, once. So you're putting it through once. Then I'm gonna circle it back and I'm gonna put it through twice. And then I'm just going to keep it going here. Let me just get this going. And then I'll, I'll show you when I'm done here. So what you're coming out with is this. So you saw what I did. I just went through that eye twice and now I've got a double chain and now you're wearing it like that. Isn't that amazing? So just so you know that you can do that too, this thing rocks, it just rocks. And if you ever have a long necklace that has a bigger eye, okay, you can do that with yours too. Uh, you really can do some fab fabulous things because that bottom part is so gorgeous. So let me get this, just put this back in this little thing, and then I'll get Kristen another one too. Um, and again, if you have any family members that you think will really like this, you can get it at any time, but you know with our males, they're terrible. Um, I would say if you're going to get something for Christmas and I have it like today, think about it because... I can get it out to you, but if um, we, the closer we get to Christmas, I'm a little worried that the closer we get to the election, that mail's going to not stop. <laughs> it's not going to work, right? So let me get one out for Kristen, who wants another one. All righty. So I will always carry these. And if it, if it turns out that you, you feel like, well, I, I like that one and I, I want to, you know, get another one or I have a friend I'd like to buy for, um, right now I have four left. And so the next time I order, I'll probably order 10 more just because it's one of those necklaces that when people see it, they just want it. Okay. I have another pair of clip-ons here. This is what I'm talking about when I say... The clip-ons clip are so cool. 117. Look at these. Oh, nope, Nancy, wait a minute. I'm going to check. All right, this is really getting ridiculous with this Nancy thing going on here. It's not on there at all. Not at all. I'm going to get you one, Nancy. Definitely, I'm going to get you 134. Thank you for coming back again because I don't know what's going on. I, and this is the only thing that happens when I'm having yours. And I feel bad because I don't want you to think I'm not listening to you. Okay, so we're going to... So you're getting one too, honey. I got it right here. Nobody gets left out. All right, let me show you this one really quick under the lens because this is like an a Marilyn Monroe earring, literally. And I love these. Look at this. Look at that, stacked. Oh, wow. Yep, she got her. Who's she, Alana? You wanna twerp me? Okay, yep, I got Nancy. Yep, I have her. Okay, I see that, okay. So anybody I know, probably Kristen Cohn wants these, right? Look at that, look at these, how 
They're so gorgeous. They remind me, they're very Monroe-esque, very. Yes, I did get Nancy. But I only have three pair of these. So let me just, I'll just stick them on the side of my ear so you can kind of see what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. Doesn't that Jackie O, Marilyn Monroe, that whole like 1958 through 62, that look right there, bam. Yeah, that's a good one. Kristen is getting one and I have two pair left after that. So if anybody wants those. Remember, diamonds are our girl's friend, best friend, right? I was so excited to see those. I was like, oh. Now that's a pair of earrings I would wear when I'm sick of wearing pierced ears. So, 117. And then I have a pair of earrings that I sold, well, I think last week I showed them in blue. I have to show this color here. I know one of our ladies snapped them up. In fact, she was on my page. I couldn't, I didn't have a picture of the earrings to put on, but she bought these in blue and she was drinking kombucha. That's our Susan, Susan C. And I don't, is she on here? But anyway, 172. And look at this color, you guys. Oh my word. Look at that. You have the hematite stones at the top and then this like um, stamping on the side. Look at the table of that stone right there. And then you have more bling at the bottom. The back is finished off like that. That color is so magnificent. I just love it. Now last week I had them in blue. This week, if this would come out in a green, I would buy it. I mean, I just love it. So 172 goes to Kristen. And that color will look good on everybody. Totally look good on everybody. So let me just show you that right there again, how pretty that is. 172 for Deb. Debbie J. And I don't find these heavy at all. I don't find too many of their earrings heavy either. Um, really, I don't. It's just a very, very beautiful color. Just that last look, and then I'll put them away. I'm gonna turn them in the lights. You see just how much bang for the buck you're getting. Yeah, I can. These are 520, and I could put them down and then pull it later. Five, 520. Here, let me, I'm gonna put them close up so you can really see. The color is almost like, uh, in, truly, if you know um, topaz, like London blue, it looks like a London blue topaz. Now there's clear stones on these where in the other ones there are the hematite, and here you can see the bling at the bottom, still is stamping there. Let me put them side by side for you to show you just the difference. So Eileen wants 172, okay. this 172 and 520 okay let me get these for you I'll just pull those later and Kristen wants blue ones too if I don't have my computer in front of me and if by chance you know I don't have enough because I don't know I'm just gonna go pull them hold on because I don't want to keep you guys waiting Oh, 
Oh yeah, I gotta know. Definitely gotta know. Yeah, I'm kind of set up like a library, so it takes a little time to maybe do the inventory, but it stays like this where it's totally worth it. All right, so let me get Eileen. She wants the blue ones, and Kristen, too. Debbie, 172. 172 in blue. Okay, because that's 520 in blue. Yeah. Let me see back here. Make sure. So Debbie gets the blue. Quick and easy. And you guys will not regret this purchase at all because they're just so blue, so blue and so pretty. So we got Debbie in blue. Okay, she's gonna check Mary Thomas wants 172. That's in the pink. Mary Thomas for these. And they're ultra light, Mary, so they won't bother your ears. The blue ones are 520. Um, let me see. So, Alana, you're saying the blue ones are 520, and who is that for? Are you saying it for you? Yeah, maybe you're just saying that just uh, than everybody else. So, as far as the blue ones, I have a total of five pair left. So we'll put those over here. If anybody else wants them, blue are number 520. I probably have 900 pieces of jewelry here. I mean, it's getting to the point where I'm like, whoo, got a lot of jewelry. And the 172 is this color. So last call, Mary said 172 blue. Oh, okay, so you don't want the 172 pink, right, Mary? So you want the blue ones. One seventy two blue. Okay, I get it. I get it now. I gotcha. I just saw the number. So we'll get those here, and then I'll put this Mary one seventy two off of here, and put five twenty on these. Okay, good. So, the blue we're done with. Yep. And I'll just kind of go over the speed to make sure I caught everybody correctly on their colors and all that. But in the meanwhile, 172 pink, I'm putting back over here along with the 520 blue. And I'm going to move on. So I showed you one pearl necklace in brass and it had a lot of bubbly pearls going all over it. Well, this one here is a little bit more muted, but it still has the same kind of flavor to it, but it's not as, it has also some crystals in it. So that's a good thing. So this is 267 and you start out with the creamy pearls. The brass chain is kind of a loop-de-loop. -loop. It's loop and loop and loop. There's the extender. And then what you have, and I'm going to put this on the bus so it lays properly. It's a little daintier, a little bit sparklier, um, maybe a little bit more um, upper notch than the other one because of that sparkle in there. The other one was just pearls. But, you know, you can see how they took a necklace with pearls and brass 
and redid another one and it really turned out very well when you have some of those little sparklies in there. So if you like 267, this will fit everybody and you have your extender on there so you can also lower it. But just one that, you know, it's just a similar look but not the same. And it just depends on how much bling and sparkle you want. I also like how they kind of doubled up the chains in here. Kind of adds more dimension to it. So, yeah. Right here. Close up. Pearl bling. Then you have bling pearl. Then pearl bling. That one there is kind of twisted. But you get the picture. And it'll lay flat on your neck. So... 267. Okay, this one here, I have maybe two left. Two to three. I think there are three in here, actually. I can tell you that this is 256. The earrings are worth the $5 alone. Look at those. Then you have this chain and you have, because this isn't laying right here, I have to put it on the bust. Let me put it on here because it's just, it's hard to hold it up. The chain is twisting. It's a little twisted. This is a stunner. It really is. Two fifty six. Look at that. You, you know, I just go, how in the world can they? This is just a stunner. But what we're going to do here is, let me just put a pin in this. Put that up here. And then, a lot of you have this earring. But if you wanted to just um, take this up a little bit, have a little bit more dimension on it, instead of those earrings, which are perfect for it, you could get this pair of earrings, either for this necklace or alone, because these... This is the beauty of it. You can interchange, okay? This is 244, and these are in fishhook wires. And they have that same kind of stone in them. So you could do something like that with this one. You know, like I said, you could use the earrings there, but if you really wanted to go a little bit more glamorous, a little bit more loud, these would match perfectly. And let me just put this here with this. And I'm going to just show you one more thing. All right, we'll, we'll get this together, right? All right, so 244 and 256, okay. All right, and I just wanna show you one last thing on this and then we can move forward. And then if you wanted to add this, this is number Number four is the ring. Look at this. Isn't that a wow? The ring is like this. It's got the same stone in it, all of that. So this whole thing would be $15. Can you stand that? So all right, let me get Kristen written up on that, 244 and 256. So on this case, I only have one left after on the necklace. I thought I had three, I only have two. So let me get that for Kristen. It was a very popular one when it came out. I'd like to see them bring it back. And 256 on the earrings. I mean, on the 256 on the necklace. And Kristen wants a ring. Okay, and that's number four. I have a ring here for you, too. 
So on the necklace, I only have one left. 256 is the necklace, and I have one left. And then I'll put these earrings away. The 244. This ring is a real stunner. Really, I love it. And it's in that darker metal. So on the ring, I have a total of three left. Maybe four. No, three. Hey, Candace, how are you? Belated happy birthday, lady. All right, so let's get Kristen on that. Well, thank you, Candace. Yeah, you know, a little hair, a little turquoise. We're good to go. So, um, all right. So I've got the ring for for um, Kristen. This is the, I have about like two or three of these left. If anybody else wants one, just check that out. Dark metal. You have that hematite stone in the middle there, and almost like a crown-like appearance. Number four. That is it really pretty. So I'll take and put that over here and we'll move on. Now, before I had a pair of a pierced earrings that looked like this one and everybody was really excited about those, but guess what? I got a pair of clip earrings too. And they look almost like that one. So for those of you who are clips, Kristen, look at these. They're the burnished copper. Let me get up close on these. There's a lot of detail. Look at that. It's almost like you bought them in Spain. Really, not kidding. There's the clip, 115. So if I, I only have three total of these. So I'm just gonna wait until I see Kristen come up with if she wants these or not. And anyone else who wants a pair of clip-on earrings that are that burnished copper. And then with, okay, I'm going to hang on to that. With that set that I just showed you, the necklace, the long earrings, that ring, I've got the perfect bracelet. And I only have two of these left. Okay, 115. Let me get that written up for you, Kristen. So we're back to the necklace that Kristen bought with those earrings, with that ring. I have two of these bracelets left. Kristen, I'm not sure if you have this one, but let me get the number out here too for the people watching at night. All right, 314. This one here, but look at the stone. It matches that necklace. It matches those earrings. It matches that ring. Isn't that a wow? And look, it's going to fit everybody. These are preformed, so they're going to go around your wrist. Susan knows. I mean, Susan, if Susan, see if you're watching. You can tell me if your bracelet flips around. If not, send up some hearts. And then this you can put on any setting that you need. So then it will actually fit you. It'll hug your wrist, and you can then have a little bit of a chain at the bottom here. But this goes so well. This is number 314. If you don't have it, Kristen, it's an absolute match to what you just bought but you tell me if you need it. And I only have two of these left. And they, um, they're they in new releases, so I, I can't get them all the time. <laughs> really? Seriously? It is gorgeous. It's just gorgeous. And it fits good, doesn't it? I mean, really. So pretty. So I'm going to put this to the side, and then you can tell me if you need that. If not, if anybody else wants it, I have two left. And if you're kind of writing your wish list right now and you want to put it on there, go ahead, and then you can always PM me later if you need it. And I think it's time for a chapstick break. Get a little bit um, dry over here. So what I have, these are fun. This is a fun pair of, of earrings. Um, 
they're whimsical. To some people, the eye means a real, like, it's not a religious symbol, but it's a, a traditional symbol in a way. So this is $2.91, and it's this gold eye. And the, inside the eye, I think this is like a blue. Let me just make sure. It says, don't blink gold post earrings. So let's get a close here. I think, I think it could be blue or black, but they're just fun. I would think it'd be more blue only because, you know, the evil eye has the blue in it. These look black. But there you go. That's a great way to look at them. They're fun. They are not going to get in the way. And they're actually conversation pieces. So anybody who sees this, it's black. Thanks, Alana. Alana has them. And they're fun. And, you know, because like anybody, you know, in the health field, you're not going to be able to wear any jewelry. But if you just have a day when you want to put your earrings on and you're going to run to work, you can take them off. They're very, um, like I said, whimsical in a way that it's like, ooh, that's different. And again, in like certain um, like Turkish cultures, Muslim cultures, the eye is a very powerful symbol. It's evil eye. It keeps away evil spirits, things like that. So, yeah, I, I think they're fun. Again, this is how they look on. Two ninety one. All right, I have the next pair of earrings. Why do, do you have like a little camera next to yours, Alana? I don't know what that means, but anyway. Okay, this pair of earrings here, they're gorgeous. They're official choirs. Look at them, they're in black. Where have you seen these before? right here. They're black. These are turquoise. Same kind of design, different look. But if you have anything in your wardrobe that's silver, that you have black, that you have a black in your bracelet, that if you have a black necklace that you're going to be wearing, these are so like gypsy-ish to me. I just love these. And I do have a decent lot of these right now. And so if you want to claim a pair, just let me know. And they'll be yours, three thirty-eight. Yeah, I don't know. Every time, every time you post, there's like a little like camera, or like it looks like a plus sign in green. I don't know. So here we are. I will put these down. If if you want them, let me know. But they are really pretty. I'll hold them up. I actually could have worn if I wasn't wearing all this. I could have worn this because I have black on tonight. They're striking. I love all the movement at the bottom. You know, it's all that really fun stuff down there. The discs have little carvings on them, and you can't see that. Let me get up close and personal on this one. And when I say, look at that, there. See what I mean? You can really see all of that. It's really fun. And that's all she wrote on those. So 338. It's a great design. And then... I have turquoise earring and burnished copper. Yeah. And you didn't think it was possible, right? But the, but it is. Here it is today. Okay, why is doing that? I have my card in here. Before, let me grab something here and see if they're over here. It must have fallen out. In the move. Okay. Then I'll have to look for later. Unless it's hidden on me here. I'll just have to suffer without them. All right, this is number 104. And I'll just have to remember the number. Look at these. Isn't that cool? There's that crackle stone. I mean, these are really fun. Look at that. The stamping on that copper. 104. I have what's left on this one here is one, two, three, four pieces. So... It's not too big. It's really pretty. And look what the turquoise does. It, it makes everybody look good. It doesn't matter who wears this color. It's just one of those colors. So if you like these, that number is 104. It doesn't surprise me that the number fell out. I've been doing a lot of remodeling down here. Kristen Cohen, 104.
but we're getting to the end where you know things are getting a little bit more organized it's just here and there little little things that we're doing what we're finding out too in mary thomas oh yeah you guys are gonna like these um i have doors i have handles on them you, you all saw my remodeling well the problem i'm having now is if it closes too tight then the uh, maybe the hooks hook onto like the back of the earrings and pull them off the board. So we went out the other day to buy like a door stopper. So now he's got to put those in. But you know, you live and you learn, right? And that's how the whole thing goes. I know you guys will enjoy these earrings. They're very pretty and it's going to look really good on both of you because that color, this color just does. I mean, it really does look pretty on everybody. So... Um, with that, everybody, I only have two of those left. So do I have any takers on that right here on the um, 104? Otherwise, I'm going to put them away, but know that I have two left. Okay, uh, there are many of you that I think have this. Not many, some of you. And the color in this, this piece is so magnificent. It just is. And I have probably three left of this. I'm going to put it on the bust. I'll, I'll show you the first part, just with the color. The little doodad earrings have that color. You don't imagine what's coming, right? This is such a pretty necklace. But I just wanted to get it lay. It, I want to, it to lay flat. Hold on, I gotta put something away here. Got to put my number back in the bag or, you know. You can't function. This is number 585. This is a wow. And for those of you who have it, send up some hearts because look at this piece. Yeah, look at that. It's so pretty. And really, my lights are not doing justice on this piece. Maybe taking it back. Yeah, so there it is. It's just a wow piece. It looks good on everybody. It really does. It's so gorgeous. I was trying to find pictures of like the headquarters of paparazzi and the inside because I wanted to show you guys on my Course of the Jewel Lady page what it, you know, what does it look like where we get these jewels from? You know, like the corporate headquarters. So I'm kind of looking down for some um, different uh, pictures that I can show you because I think maybe you will want to see that. You know, where do we get our jewels? What does it look like? You know, it's not a fly-by-night operation. They've paid for everything. They own nothing. That's good business for sure. So Kristen Cohen, I'm going to get you one of these, honey, and you're going to look really, really good in this. And make sure you wear this with your bobby because that is going to look really good. And on that one, I only have two left. And Debbie Jansen, 585. Lovely color. And now I only have one left. So one lucky person. And it goes home with you. Just that. So pretty. I just want to get it so you can just really relish in that color. So gorgeous. Yeah. One left. All right. Guess what? Box number three. Yay, we're done with two. It's Saturday night and we are going to party, right? And then that'll be all she wrote on this one. So I showed you that ring that was like a crown. All right, so we know that one. Then I showed you the Queen's Jewels, this one here. I still have more of these. If you like this one, that is 149 I know a lot of you got this already. It's a wow. It's decadent. It's gorgeous. It's all of the above, but why not, right? So that's that. And then I have this one here is number 13. I think many of you already have this one, but if not, let me get a close up on this one so you can see that you don't always have to be 
all blinged out, right? There's that white crackle stone and there's some blue turquoise. You've got kind of that beaded band in silver tone. It's really pretty on, stretchy back, fits sizes six to 10. Then, uh, let's see what else do we have here? 155, this one here. This little beauty, uh, she's relatively new. Really pretty, in silver tone. All that roping that goes around that there, crackle stone on that, very pretty. Again, it goes with the motif of all of this, of this, this whole piece, all of this. And then the last piece is this, and let me show you that one. This one would be 24. This is number 24. There's some um, burnished silver in there. You can see that. It makes a great pointer ring. You know, this... The, the whole set comes together. If you like my bracelet, right here, this is 568. It's all of the crackle stone there, and it stretches. So if you have some turquoise pieces at home, and they're either copper or silver or even gold, this is gonna go with all of them because there's no metal in here at all. So this one here, 568, if anybody would like to give this one a go, Let's see here. And then <clears throat> the next bracelet that I'm wearing is this 144. I'm not gonna take mine off. Let me just unwrap one here for you. Oh, here, you got it open already. It's a very substantial piece. It's very nice. And it's number 441. And when I say it, when you feel this thing, it's really weighted. It's really nice. So that's that. I have it on here. I kind of doubled up. I went all out. Like, if I'm going somewhere, I'm going to be the one you're going to look at in this. And then I'm going to act like I don't see it, right? So, <laughs> so much for all that looking, right? But anyway, so that's 441 for that one. If you just like the cuff alone. And just a little, like, preview of what I have on for those of you who might have come in later. Went through the rings that I was showing today. And then, um, of course, we're going to show you what I have around my neck right here. Some of you already have this one because it's a blockbuster. For those of you who don't or are watching later, I know a lot of you have this piece. Throw up some hearts if you like it, if it's something that you enjoy. And let me get this back here. It does come with its own little set of earrings. You can swap them out like I did today. And then what I like about this, it's easy to wear. It's $4.90. And it has the preformed neck on it, but it has a chain in the back that you can wear with, it's like an extender on it. And it's like a two inch extender. So it, it lays fine. And you can see, I, I went layered and layered and layered and it looks really good. But you can also just go with this, like this. So those of you who don't have this one yet, I have it out, I have a decent amount, and it is a blockbuster, which means I can get it at any time should I run low on inventory. It's a blockbuster for now. Sometimes they don't know how long they keep things in the blockbuster, but for as long as I've been in paparazzi, it is a blockbuster, and that's a good thing. But I do have a decent quantity, so for those of you who like this one and want that look, and don't wanna spend a lot right now, it's only $5, comes with its own earrings, and it's one of those things that, um, I think you'll really enjoy. And then we'll get on to this bag here. Brand new pair of earrings, guys. Bam, right? These are winners. These are definitely winners. They're a teardrop earring and they have two rows of hematite stones. And so of course they do everything in this pear shape and we know why, because it's so flattering to everybody's shape in their face, skin tones, things like that. So this is 91. Fish hook earrings. Ready? Look at these. So what you're going to see here, it's going to sparkle. But it's not like you're wearing um, like rhinestones where they're sparkling across the room. Those are great if you want that look. But maybe you want to be a little bit more toned down but still really pretty. Well, take a look at these because I don't think they can get any prettier than this. Seriously. They're very, very pretty. They're muted, and I know that's hard to think that they can be muted because they're long and they're sparkly, but really when they're here, 
You don't really see it till I'm turning my head and you're wondering, oh, what does she have on her ears? So if you like this one here, they're number 91. They're very light, you know, the lead and nickel free. They're not gonna bother your ears. And that's another kind of close up. Again, these are great with jeans because they're just more muted. And you can have that kind of dressed down, dressed up jean look. And there you go, brand new. And on this one here, I didn't buy a whole lot. I think I have six of these. So if there's something that you like in here, let me know either now or send me a personal message later. I'm not, I don't think those are gonna last too long, but we'll see. And you know, as long as you're dressing up, let's say you were wearing this one here and you bought this one here, you would have spent $10, which is Starbucks for you and your husband or your child or your friend, right? But if you just wanted to buy this one and this cuff bracelet, which is a winner, it's not too dressed up. It's number 739. It's just that crackle stone with a lot of silver around it. This cuff will fit everybody and if you need it to be a little bit smaller, you can kind of work it. I wouldn't say go push it on it or anything, but you can get it to sort of fit your wrist, even if you're a little bit bigger. But I think once it goes on your wrist, it does kind of melt inward or outward because of the wrist size that it's on, because you might be pushing it in a certain way. But it, you, you could actually have this on this hand and this on this hand and your other, this here and maybe a different pair of turquoise earrings on and you've spent $20. So. $7.39, relatively new, and I have a decent quantity of these, so you can always come to fit back to me later. Uh, I'm sure I'll have them in stock. All right. Brass earrings. Hoops. Mm. It's great. I love getting my hoops. And these are cool because they are bigger hoops. And maybe that's not in everybody's agenda right now, but there are people that just love their big hoops. And I gotta get these so they're not tangled. Because when they go in the bag, they get a little tangled. $7.39, okay, Lori, it's yours. Get 24 for Nancy. Um, 24 for Nancy. What was 24, guys? Just kind of remind me. I don't, I'm not getting anything from Nancy at all. This is really bad. I hate this. Not at all. And Alana, I don't know if you're seeing it on your side. But I'm not understanding why I'm not getting it on my side. All right. So 24. Let me think here. Um, 24 ring. Okay. Did not, but I will. Right now, Nancy. You got it. Just do your, just, you know, we'll hang out there. And if anything, I miss anything, just send me a personal message. You know, like we've done in the past. Um, I don't really know why. And I... I'm not going to call Facebook. They're not going to know. They don't care, right? They're just too worried about blocking political content of anybody right now. So why would they have time to help a customer, right? Yeah, that's the world we live in. So anyway, let me get Nancy's name on this. This is really pretty. Let me get you close up on that. Yeah, you'll like that. Crazy. Here we go. Crazy. Yeah, that's where he's getting it from, right? Okay, let's get back to this number 82. I'm going to make sure I got my little card. Oh, here it is. Oh, it went on one of the hoops. So I know these are big, but I kind of like them. I really do. They're 82. They're in brass. Look at the size of these. 
And I'm gonna put the lens on so you can just see. Look at this. It's like, it's kind of bezeled. You see that, like into a point on each side? So it really reflects the light. And yeah, they're big. And you know, there are some people just love big earrings. I think they're really cool. I mean, you can wear them and you don't need to wear any other jewelry because they are so substantial. And that maybe now with having to wear a mask all the time, it would be hard to wear them. But you know, you decide because I have them and I bought a decent quantity because in my world, hoops, no matter what kind they are, always go. They always go. So I thought I was gonna get any hoop that I could find because I just know that, that there's somebody out there who's gonna get them. So if you like a bigger hoop in brass, remember I'm going for all the different metals too because I'm finding that we all need them. So number 82, if you just all of a sudden one day had this epiphany that you needed to have a pair of big brass hoops, I have them so you know where you can get them. And now I know a couple of you have this necklace. I love this color, love it. And I have a decent quantity of these. Um, I don't think you can get too much of this color. I think you can wear it any time of the year. Let me just get in here and get this. You could also double this one up and make it almost look like a Z piece. This is 717. And it's like a flamingo pink almost. And then you have all these baubles in here. And it looks so good on the bust. If you're a lady that loves different colored pearls, and I think I've mentioned this before, but there's a certain shopping channel where they, they deal exclusively in colored pearls. Well, they're a lot of money. They are a lot of money, and that's okay. If you want to spend it, you go ahead. But if you just want to, you know, put your toe in the water a little bit and just wear something that maybe isn't a real pearl but has a really good color on it, looks really pretty on, try it. It's only $5, and I guarantee you, you're going to love this piece because that color looks so good on everybody. And like I said, let's just try this. I'll try... I'm going to drop something again. All right. I think it's like station break time. Every time I drop something, it'll be like, what, what's she doing, you know? Um, I'm gonna open one of these up and I'm gonna try that. I'm trying to do a double like a Z piece. Oh, we've got time, right? You kind of see, that's this is what you get. You play with your jewelry. So this is on the first setting. So I'm gonna open up another one and I'm gonna put it on, yes. And Lisa, I think you have these. I'm pretty sure you do, right? And if you have, if you have blue eyes, this is like the color for you, for sure. But but anybody, because it's such a beautiful color. And I'm going to put two of these together, and we're going to see how it looks together. Um, and maybe it'll have more impact, right? Huh. Well, this one here is... I'm not sure why I have this on here. Well, that's odd. Hmm. Bear with me here. I'm finding some secret thing out here. Oh, no. Well, that is odd. Live and learn. The first one that I opened up is this one, okay? This is Uptown. They sent me, and I just realized this now, so we're going to put this one away. I'm going to show you what they really sent me in the order. This is another one. This is different, but I didn't realize. Some, sometimes it happens from them. This is called Ballroom Service. Yeah, look at this one. It's the same color, but look at all these things. Like, it's not the same necklace. So what happens is they probably sent me that one that I opened up. The ones that I sold look like that. And then at the bottom here, some of them are the ballroom. So well, let's just try this. On air, yeah, anything can happen, right? But you know what? Look at this now. If you like this one, I mean, wow, I'm so, I'm excited and I'm kind of blown away. But you know what? That's what happened with this pandemic. You know, I started getting orders where things weren't in it at all. Now I'm getting orders where they put two different necklaces in the order, but that's okay. So if you like 717 with the double row in here, go for it. 
and I'll just mark you down on one that says Uptown Ballroom because these are different necklaces. Hmm, that is really strange. Wow. They did. They absolutely put, and that was the one that they put up there. Okay, so back to this. If you like this one, you can tell me if you like the single strand for that same number, and I'll give you that one. I only have one of those. Or the double strand. They're the same color. Um, paparazzi, I think you need to keep your, uh, you know, what you say, like your quality control checks, but still, it's okay. It's a pretty necklace. So if you'd like to have this one right here, just say 717 double, and that'll be it. 717 seven, D, and we'll make sure you get that one. And then if you just like the one with the one strand, which is gorgeous too, but see there, I can see how they made this mistake. But they're all pretty, so you wouldn't want to put two of them on, right? Okay. Ooh. All right, so I'm going to put this one away. Oh, seven, seven. want the Uptown Ballroom. Okay, let me grab this for you. All right, I got the Uptown Ballroom right here, and I'm going to put that one back in the, in the thing here because the other ones are ballroom service. So, yeah, somebody... Somebody did something, but that's okay. That Uptown one is beautiful. So I'm gonna give that one to you. I'm just gonna put it in the bag, make sure you get this one. That's the one, right, the, the bubbly one. So uh, do they call these things bloopers, you know? They should like put a whole segment together of like bloopers. It, you know, it does, but they have very similar names. So I'm really thinking that's what happened with paparazzi. Yeah. I think somebody, they probably had them somewhere side by side or they went out and they thought, oh, the same one. You know, they have a big warehouse, so that must be it. But I'm going to make sure that Kristen gets this one that says Uptown Ballroom. But I only ordered one, so... Live and learn. I'm going to go change my database now to make sure I have probably that one in there. But yeah, that's really interesting. Yeah, very interesting. I'm thinking that they probably put a couple in here that were uptown and then they ran out and they picked the ballroom one. Because I have ballroom, ballroom. And I think I have another uptown in here. Yeah, here's another Uptown. Ooh, wee doggies, right? That crazy. Ballroom, ballroom. And you know, when I'm putting them in the bag here, I'm not even reading the titles. Yeah, so I'm going to definitely up my database, but I still have one Uptown left. So if anybody um, wanted the Uptown, the single strand with the kind of bubbly feel to it, not the double. This is ballroom. This is double strand. So, um... We'll just leave it at that. And I'll up my database with the correct information and get that all figured out because that's just how I work, right? Hmm. All right, so I'll put that one away. Oh, the next wrap that I have, you guys. I was going to keep one of them. I, I might. I don't know. I'm really... I'm thinking about it, but this is tough looking, really tough looking. Like it's, it's a wow one. I bet you're all wondering, Ooh, I wonder what she has, right? Well, I'm going to show you in a second. It's on a leather, not suede band, 823. It's thicker and it has all of these be bevel, bezel set stones. There's no clips on them. Look at that, all leather. And then you have two of these snaps on it to hold it, but you probably have just two settings here. So what does this look like on? This, look at that. That is top. It sort of reminds me of like the Magnificent Musings styling, you know, that kind of like tough chick throw on a leather jacket with this, you know, you know, have your, your brand name handbag with you. You're looking hot. 
on your, your all it. And that's really what this is all about. Plus on these, you can wear them on the flip side. You can. You just put them in like this and you can wear it. I've seen that happen too. And now you just have the studs. I would never hide a bling. So this here is 823. And if anybody likes this one, it's here for you tonight. Brand new, hot off the press. 823. And we only have three pieces left, guys. So show's almost over. I know we had a little extra long night. Well, not really. We kind of back to normal here because I started getting some new pieces in. But um, this next bracelet is semi-new. And I really love this one. I love the way it looks. It is $7.93. It is, you have to see this up close. It's not heavy, but it's all kind of like, filigreed little half spears. I love what they do with their elastic on the inside. There's two that really make it hold its shape and stays on. And it is just really pretty on, very delicious looking to me. Um, it's just kind of got that edge to it. So if you like that one, definitely. All right. Well, here's one. If you got those big brass earrings and you wanted to wear like a longer necklace, I actually got two of these just to kind of see, kind of feel the waters a little bit with you guys if you liked them. And so I'm going to show you this one. There's only two of them. And then to me, I would have worn these with the big brass earrings. This is a great look for that. It just kind of has that, that edge again. These are number 58, 58. It has tassel earrings. Here's the brass. Here's the extender. And then this. Kind of cool, hey? It's almost like, I don't know. It's almost like, like a Renaissance looking symbol to me. But it's going to look like this on. So you see why I'm saying like the big brass earrings? Because like say you're going to wear something one whole color. And I'd probably say like a black. You throw those big old earrings on, you have this on. All that's going to be really cool. You can throw in a couple of your brass um, rings with this too. So this is number 58. It's not the usual thing that I carry, but I just thought it was very unique in that, in that kind of circular design in there. And so two of them. Two lucky people will get it if you want it. And I have one more piece, I think, after this. And then show's over, kids. Brand new pair of earrings. Wow. You're getting ready for the holiday with these. And these are not too long and they're not too heavy. Let me just show you these. I'm going to wow you. Number 22, Fish Hook Wires. I love these. Okay, there you go. Let me show these. See the stamping? See the bling up here? All of the teardrop and then all of those little blingy things here. All right, let me get the 58 with yours and the brass hoops. You guys think about these for a while and I'm going to write this other order up and then uh, I'll come back and, and handle everybody else. number 58 and I'll give you the one that's brand new here yeah I have this um, homeschooling deal going on now I gotta get the big brass hoops here And I literally am in the house all day long. I can't, I mean, I can't leave. I can't go food shopping. I, I can't. I'm going to write the 58. I'll put the brass hoops down here and grab them for your rose. 
rows M brass hoops. And I'll get that number. So friends are like, well, you know, um, okay, she wants 22. And the 22, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Whoa. So cool. Um, a couple friends, well, you know, can, I, can you come over? No, I can't. I can't leave the house. I'm in the house because we're doing homeschooling. I'm not really the teacher, but I'm there for lunch, and I'm there with the timer. Like, you got to get back. And, you know, like the hel hovering helicopter during the day. So... You know, who knew in retirement that we were all going to be doing stuff like this? But you know what? It is what it is. So I take what I have to take. And um, it's just it's just very, very strange. And who knows how long it will last. But at least they're getting their education, right? <laughs> you guys. All right. And Mary T. Twinning. Oh, geez. That's why I love you guys. So... I always have to remind my friends, no, I really can't come over during the day because I'm, well, bring Gabe. Well, I can't just bring Gabe. I have another little one at home. I, you know, she's going to school. So, but that's how it goes. And her mom is going to try to get back to work, and she takes off half days now to kind of help with the thing. And then she's probably going to go to a longer day now because we kind of know the routine. A lot of things for mothers these days that they have to do, right? So on these, I have a total of three left if anybody else wants them. That's all I could get. Lori Joyner wants them too. Okay. I couldn't get any more of these. It's just like I said, if you get to your cart, the person in front of you, they take them out of your cart. So I was just really happy to get these, but I was like, wow. I really wish I could have gotten more. But I guess that's how the ball rolls, right? There's nothing you can do if that's how they have the company set up. So, all right, so I have two pair left of that number 22, these gorgeous, gorgeous, really fantastic earrings. Anybody want some? Personal message me. I'm going to hang out here for like 10 seconds with you guys, and um, I'll probably get my invoices out tomorrow. And on, on that note, I think that's all I have. If anybody has any other questions about anything, Debbie, yep, I knew I knew somebody was going to get them. They're too good to pass up. So now I only have one pair left. Really pretty. I'm suspecting that a lot more of these dressier earrings are going to be coming out if they haven't come out already the closer we get to the holidays because that's just kind of like what you think they're going to do. It's like, oh yeah, people are getting geared up for whatever kind of holiday they're going to have. So, you know, like, will it be the normal Thanksgiving? I don't know, you know. All right, that you guys, it was fun. Thank you so much for shopping with me. And I will see you Wednesday, hopefully, if everybody can come and, and hello and thank you to all the newcomers. And for all you guys watching at where you're at, hi, and it'll be, you know, good to hear from you guys too. So, um, Till we meet again, stay safe, take care, and drink your kombucha now, okay? See you later.